Hello guys, this is Wesnator888 here and I'm back again with an episode of Fishing Planet Livestream. Yes guys, I'm here to do my livestream. I'm just going to quickly get a few edits done for you guys so I can actually have this livestream more sorted out. So it's a lot more sorted. Uh, just give me a moment here. But hopefully everyone's having a great day today. Uh, like I said, I'm just trying to sort five things out at the same time. <laughs> I want to have my PC load up so I can just pull the description in straight away. So it saves me a lot of time later on. Once everything loads up on my PC properly. But again, hopefully everyone's enjoying themselves and having an awesome Boxing Day. And obviously I will get vamps in the chat in just a moment so that we can then get this all going on. Let's see, where's that one? There it is. All these things I have to do just to get things copied over. <laughs> Lovely. Copy. Paste that. Awesome. Copy that. Go down here. Change the thumbnail because I have actually made a thumbnail for this guys yes I have made a thumbnail so this will now change add it to the playlists uh, that one that one where's that other one where is it gone no 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 where has that one gone where is it where is it Come on, we have a gun. Oh no, don't say it's gone and done a dis there it is. It's done a dis it did do a disappearing act to me. So just remove them tags, put them ones in. Uh remove, 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 remove. Uh, see how many of these I can actually add in now without too much of a problem. Ah, copy. Paste that. Copy that. Paste that. Copy that. Paste. Uh. Oh, why? I then spell correctly. L B U R B O T. Uh, what was the other fish? Sorry, guys. I am just quickly checking so I can get all these in and edited without having to worry too much. Dum 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 dum. Man. T. L. E. R. E. D. S. A. L. Salmon. And salmon and notes. Was it normal fairy or is it a different fairy? See how they spelt it. Fairy. T R I O T. There we go. Right. So that's most of the fish that I needed to write on that part. Just got to copy the rest of them in. Hopefully, I have enough room. Probably no my luck, I don't, so I'll have to sort it out as I go along. But yes, guys, as you know, I am here, ready to do all of this fishing. As you can see with the title, we are going to go to White Moose Lake. We are going to be fishing quite a few of the special fish that are on at the minute. As you saw me just check, we have the Atlas Salmon. We have a Crystal Burbot. And we have the Antler Salmon. I meant to say Furry Trout than anything else, and I messed up on my pronunciation. 
and not really much of a challenge there we go so that's all there that's all there descriptions there which I'll move up so if people want to see the description a bit quicker is there so then go and check his channel out and save that should now please just set and be done mm, just saved just double check make sure that does say saved come on, come on. has it changed yes it has awesome and that has saved the changes sweet right I don't have to worry about that I can turn that off now so yeah as you can tell I oh, just sort it all out so I'm all done and sorted for the Fishing Planet live stream. So, we are now going to get in Dark Shadow Vamps in the chat, so do bear with me. Uh, where is he? Where is Vamps? There he is. Sorry about this, guys. I know it takes a bit of time for me to get into there. So, if you do have any questions for us, please do put them down in the comment section down, well, in the live chat, and we will be with you. And hello, Dark Shadow Vamp! Oh, not much, dude. I am ready to go. I've just got all my description and the thumbnail sorted out, as everyone should be now noticing. Um, but yes, hopefully you like the thumbnail as well. <laughs> it's something different. I actually worked on this one for a bit. It took me about 10 minutes to get the thumbnail done. I say 10 minutes. It probably only could have taken me two, but I had to get the right um, colorization of some words. <laughs> so did you have a good Christmas? Uh, Christmas number one, yes. No, that's all right then. That's good to hear. <laughs> Are you ready for the challenge then today? Oh gosh, what's that? I haven't even touched any of the missions, so I am going to be start. He's got a head start on me, guys. Well, yeah, I am level fifty-one. This is obviously we're playing on PlayStation, just in case anyone's wondering, because obviously I've done quite a few live streams and videos on the PC, so there is a major difference from the PC and the PlayStation version on my level, basically, and the amount of cash I have. Um, I've got a ton more items, and I've got a lot more room for my stashes of stuff. So yeah. Um, so obviously, what level are you again, Vamps? I can't remember. 38. 38. Well, at least you've got enough to go to White Moose Lake, haven't you? I have enough to get probably to most of them, but I'll definitely be getting the cash to get to the others. And Yeah, well, at least we're going to White Moose Lake. That is and also, um, with looking at the missions, if you guys are still look, trying to do the missions, um, there are like one or two of the higher leveled ones where you will actually get a one day pass as a gift from the game itself when you yes. get certain ones done oh yeah my Christmas ones don't show up because I've already completed all the Christmas ones on the Playstation <laughs> just in case anyone's wondering yeah you do get quite a few um, things yeah, for the free the first one which is to interrogate the Krampus Eels will give you a one day pass to Sander Baggersy which is a level 40 Two, but I do believe mm, I'm gonna say it's lower than that. I think it's level 14 for it. Oh, I can double check. Hold on, let me just. Sandra Baggersy, that's a high level. It's the canal. Oh, it's level 12. Oh, no, I'm thinking. Oh, no, I might be looking at the wrong one. Let me just double check. I'm my mind's just completely gone now. At the minute, hold on. Uh, Fourth of July events, Christmas events. Right, the eel. You went to the different one. Oh, uh, that one I thought I'd. Okay, Sandbagger. Yeah, oh, yeah, that's a void. What? what? I gotta go there? Damn! Well, that's not happening in this bit, yeah, but wow, I've got, I've got a huge grind when I get the eel mission done. Um, And then the Maku Maku is the other one, which is very expensive, as anyone will know. Maku Maku is level 58. But you do also get the. Um, that for a day as well. Um, once you yeah. get up to a certain, yeah. Point. Obviously, we're going to White Moose Lake today. Um, so obviously, we're going to be hunting for certain fish. Now, Vamps, have you got? 
I'm going to ask you this. Have you got your ground bait of a pure snow? I have yet to do that. Right, I'm going to see. I'm not going to guarantee this. I am going to see if I can send you a few. Because I actually have quite... Oh, I've got quite a few. Um, so, send gift. Can I send them? I actually no. do have some. Uh, how many fireworks do you have? <laughs> oh, dear. Put that in. Put that in, put that in. Fireworks, I have quite a few, actually. How many? Well, I'm going to ask if you have more than 250. 25. 25 total. Right. Oh, no. Did that just send the whole lot? No, it sent one, didn't it? It's a nine. Hold on. I must put. Ah, there we go. I just send a few now. Obviously, this is all the PS4 ones. This is what I've actually got myself, guys. Um, obviously, I know I had someone who sent me quite a few on PC, and I do appreciate it. I was trying to find his name, and I can't remember his name. Um, so I do appreciate it. When I do remember the name, I will give you a shout out. Unless you come in chat, then I'll be able to give you a shout out in the chat. Right, let me send you a few more here. What is up, Venomous Jack? That is the person, Venomous Jack. Thank you, Venomous Jack. You're the one who sent me them fireworks on the PC. I really do appreciate the amount you did send me on the PC. Thank you very much. I will try and do a video on the PC for what me and Vamps are actually going to be doing in the live stream. Because obviously it's a bit different. Um, so, like you guys can see, I've got quite a few baits here and there. And quite a few fireworks. So, obviously, I've sent a few to Vamps. Hopefully, he's going to make sure that they are equipped in his stash. Unfortunately, I can't well, give are. him any of the pure snow. Um, yeah, that's something that I had to get myself. Yeah, um, as you can see, I actually have a full set of tent on me. Yes, I have quite a lot. And as you can see, all this mega ground cookie bait though was actually from last year. Yeah, I had a lot. <laughs> I have a lot from last year, and I don't even need it for this year. This is obviously on the PS4 version, by the way, guys. Um, as you see, I've got quite a few of the normal events done. Um, but yeah, like I was mentioning, for me, 24 for the snow glasses. And two Bitcoin for the snowman cap. <laughs> it's like, really? Um, but yeah, we're going to try and complete quite a few of these um, missions. Obviously, the Santa's headlamp, you can't put on without it being a cap. Um, but you can't make any money from that. Um, I trust most if it was... If that... <laughs> yeah, well, I've <laughs> kept the ground bait just in case because obviously I thought I might do a huge grind on the PlayStation, but obviously I'm doing more on PC for Fishing Planet. I've kept it on the PlayStation. It's just so I can test things when they bring it out again. Um, if there's any problems like there have been this year for the ground bait, well, the Christmas ground bait, uh, unfortunately, to me, it seems like there's been a load of problems with it. Um, but I'll keep it just in case, and when they do fix it when it's out next time, we can be sorted for it all. Um, so yeah, obviously, like I've got in the title, we're going to White Moose Lake. Obviously, I've got, just check my stashes, um, to see if I need to bring anything else with me. I don't think I do, because I'm pretty sure I'm set up yet. See, I've still got all three of them, ground bait, um, if a gingerbread feeder ground baits. So I'd send them to people if I could, if people need them. Even the wag Christmas Waggler, I don't even need that no more. Um, you know, I'm surprised some people actually lose them. But then it's probably not sent up the rods uh, quite correctly. And yeah, I've pretty much kept almost every single item I've ever bought while playing the PS4. Uh, so yeah, I've never actually thrown anything away. Even like, even you can see here my rods and my reels. Uh, I know you can't really see them very much, but I've got like four spinner reels. I think I've got one caster out of that lot, which is that one there. Uh, another match rod, which is the Argo, uh, another a bottom feeder and a cart feeder, and obviously quite a few reels, even more than one of some of them, like them two there. So I've got quite a few, and my cart rods are there. I use ground baits now and again. Um, but obviously for this event, which we're going to do, I'm going to need ground baits. So of course I've got a heavy, medium, and a light uh, feeder. So that's where I'm going to be putting the pure snow into because obviously for them you're going to be fishing, believe it or not, crystal burbot. Um, and 
from what I remember in the challenge, and I can show you guys because I've actually done it um, last year a bit. Uh, the Crystal Burbot is not that one. Not that one. It's definitely not that one. But I need that. That's why we're going to be taking the fireworks because this we can try and get a free. Yes, guys, a free. And you're hearing it from me. A free kayak join this Christmas event. I bet Vamps will be happy about this. It's an elf kayak. Oh, jeez. Yeah, a uh, ride of... Not sure about the elf part, but yeah, no, free no, no. kayak? Right, oh, it's, yeah. Yeah, it's kayak. It's Christmas design. But it's, it, it says, now obviously part of this is cut out on my side, guys. I can't help that. If I was on the PC, I could show a bit better. Um, but I did this during the Halloween. I thought it was a bit weird. But this actually came up during the Halloween event because I was riding a fish. But it says in the description anyway, uh, fishy, fishy ri racing. Ride a Christmas fish for 1,640.4 feet in one go. So obviously with White Moose Lake, it should be possible if we get uh, the furry trout or the antler salmon or maybe even the crystal burbot. As long as we don't bring the fish in completely, we'll be fine now. Obviously the weight for the furry trout is 13 pounds. That's the unique, that's the highest I've had. The antler salmon, it's actually a bit bigger when I find it. Uh, biggest I've had is a 24.5 pound and Crystal Burbot, believe it or not, is actually a lot heavier. Uh, where is it? <laughs> That's just me having to find it and I can't find it. It's probably a lot lighter than what I thought. think then. Uh, where is it? Where's my Crystal Burbot? Wow, it must be a lot lighter. There we go, Crystal Bear, about ten pound well ten point eight pounds. So probably the Atlas Sam is gonna be the one to try and get us the uh the fish. And obviously, yeah, I haven't even done that much on the Christmas one. So so far I've got to get fifty Crystal Bear Bots. I think it goes up to two hundred and fifty. Obviously for the PlayStation I haven't hit enough people with snowballs. Sadly. Uh same goes for the Deer Hunter, which is the Antler Summit. I've still got to get 50, then it goes up. Obviously, oh, it's 150 we've got to get all together. But obviously, the furry, or fur, bearing trout, which is the furry trout, we need 150 and we'll get a Santa's hat for it. Um, so, these are some good, helpful things. Obviously, now fireworks is we have to blow up 250 fireworks. <laughs> Should be easy enough. Um, and, this, and you get a Santa's jacket, so I want to see exactly how much you get for it. I think you have to use it and it blows up for helping people out. Um, but yeah, they're the main ones we're going to try and do and how many of them we can do is going to be a mystery. Uh, obviously, I won't be doing much of the snow fighter in this stream uh, because obviously me and Vamps will be by ourselves in it. Um, Yes, they can. The event gear can be used as standard gear all year round. So you don't just have to have it just during the event. You can have it yeah. whenever. But getting these done can only be done during certain events, sadly. Um, yes, yes, you can um, fire snowballs with the slingshot. Um, I do actually have the slingshot on the PlayStation version. But you can actually add it to the slingshot for your character um, when we get to the lake. I'll show you that I can add it onto it because I'll just show it will add on. But I'm not going to put it onto the actual slingshot. I'm not going to keep it on the slingshot because it'll waste the bit of bait because I need to put it on the feeder. So I'm bringing three feeders. I'm bringing my lightest one. Yes, my standard basic feeder rod set you get for free. Apart from the only thing I've changed is the reel. And I think the, uh, the line that you can have for it. They're the only two things I've changed for it. And I'm going to be using two stronger rods, which are going to be a bit over the top, um, but they should just be about absolutely fine. Uh, best is £20. And I'm going to be bringing four, believe it or not, feeder rods, which are way overpowered, um, apart from one of them, which will be fine. The Ardix will be fine. The other three are just way overpowered. Uh, I can't remember what size hooks we have to use for these. I think it's maybe a one to three out hooks. Uh, obviously, guys, as you know, I use barbless while I'm fishing. Um, especially on the PS4. Anyway, enough ado's. I'm going to get my license. And buy the advanced license. And now obviously I'm going to make sure I've got enough. I'm going to say this enough bait on me. And hopefully, Vamps, you've remembered to set up your rods just correctly because I know. <laughs> 
happens when you I'm use just using my theater rod. So. Yeah. yeah, so I need to bring... Technically, I don't have to bring half this bait with me. As you can see, I've got tons of Christmas stuff from last year as well still. See, 233 ginger cookies. I've never used them, apart from a few. Um, so I'm going to need to get some spawn sacks, some eggs in, natural eggs, and cut bait. And this is before I start fishing, because I know I'm going to need cut bait for everything. Uh, cut bait, right? One, two, three. You want the cut bait for the burbot? <laughs> yes. Uh, from what I know, it's preferred is small cut bait. I think you can use the medium. I can't remember. <laughs> to be honest, I haven't done it in a long time, and I haven't even looked yeah, up. Yeah, medium or the small will, will yeah. work. Um, obviously, you have to have the pure snow in the feeder because if not, you just get the normal burbots. Um, from what I remember. But obviously, I'm going to get some of these trout and salmon. I'm going to try and use the natural eggs because it should get the trout a bit easier. Um, same for using the spawn sacks and the natural, well, the artificial eggs as well because they should get them in a bit easier. Uh, backpack, yes, backpack, yes, backpack, yes. So, this is more for just us prattling around, having a laugh, and having some fun. And obviously, you guys can see exactly. How we play, how we do things, and for some reason I cannot find my spawn sacks, which I think is a level. F oh, there, yeah, thirty-nine level. Wow, that's quite a bit of cash for them. And you don't really get as much as you do for the other stuff, but it's fine. Um, and hello, hang on, get this again. Yeah, hey, Doctor Scroob. Yes, hello, Doctor Scroob. Uh, so I need to just remove this comment because that is not right uh, does it give you an A mark no uh, slingshots don't give you an A mark uh, I wish it did because it would help but no the slingshot doesn't give you an A mark unfortunately if it did I'd use it but unfortunately it just doesn't have one uh, what I might do is well actually I'll show you I'll put some like I said I'm going to put some ground I'll put some ground bait in this, uh, snow, pure snow ground bait in my cat and I'll show you. Um, yes, I had a great Christmas. Obviously, I did my stream with Vamp, uh, with Dr. Scroob. Uh, yeah, Dr. Scroob. So, we had a bit of fun with Seven Days to Die. We're still trying to figure out what we're going to do for the whole night. It's a bit of an American, we're thinking of. Um, got enough of them. More than enough of them. And... I've got some medium cut bait, duck bait, just in case, and I've got more than enough of them as well. And just in case, I have a ton, and yes, I'm going to say this, a ton of red worms. <laughs> because I just kept collecting red worms and I never really used them that much. <laughs> you can get a lot just for collecting each one each day, right? Mm. Anyway, I'm traveling on to White Moose Lake now. Uh, I don't know if Vamps is all there before me. Um, looks lovely. Oh, thank you, Dr. Drew, that it looks lovely. Uh... I'm actually freeing up some room. I didn't even check to make sure I have enough room for anything else. <laughs> I'm an idiot, though. Um, you heard it yourself. Well, at least you had a great Christmas, Venomous Jack, and I'm glad to hear it. Um, you're, you're feeling stuffed. Eh, it's fine. It was 24 hours later. I've put enough videos out during that time, and did a few recordings so even some of them may say Merry Christmas join it and people be like why 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 you wishing people Merry Christmas when it's way past it right so I'm going to make sure I get it so it's a friends only one obviously again guys I'm only on PS4 just in case anyone from who's on PC goes oh I can join you unfortunately because we're on PS4 PC players can't join it's not cross play unfortunately um, it's cross regional play but it's not cross play sadly um but just in case anyone wouldn't, yeah, that is Vamps, he is level 38, I should have seen that. Now, I did mention that, obviously, I played this before, well, I played it a bit as a different file, on, let me just show you guys, on PlayStation, and I said I did quite a few tournaments. Now, as you can see there, I've done altogether, what, nine tournaments, so they're the range I came in, one first, four silvers and four bronze, you know, that's set up, I have, I've not even been on this profile in ages, um... But this is basically all the starter stuff I usually use at times. You know, I've still got the basic there. So, yeah, I've still got all my basic stuff. Uh, I think. 
yeah, I've gone with a bit of a match, two feeders, and then the spinner. Anyway, that's the profile that I play now and again with. I was actually going to do the series as that, but unfortunately the name was taken. Uh, but yeah, anyway, we're at White Moose Lake, so I am now set and ready. Now, obviously, I've still got one fish to catch here. I may or may not catch it, but I'm not too worried. So anyway, we're going to park ourselves up this end. And we'll wait for vamps. <laughs> You're both sa How we got a sad face, Dr. Scroob? How? Obviously, the Christmas tree is up and running on the version I have, because obviously PS4 I actually completed. I haven't done it yet fully on the PC. And you never know, we might get a glimpse of Santa in his sleigh going past with fishies. But at least my Christmas tree is shining brightly as ever. For some reason it's shining. Right, I'm going to check what present I got here, because obviously it's every day up till the new year. And I got some more fireworks! Lovely! <laughs> I know it's sad. Um, for some reason I always feel like it's dark when I come out and play this now on the PlayStation than before. It's weird. I think it's the Christmas lighting. The they I don't it. know. It just seems like every single location seems really dark to me. You know, the PC doesn't seem that dark, yet the PlayStation it really does seem a lot darker. Yeah, the PC doesn't have candy canes on it. Oh, that's good to know. Um, but then again, I'll have to see if I get my Christmas tree fully done and I'll be able to see it at the same time. But at least, Venomous Jack, thank you for letting us know that the PC doesn't have the candy canes. Either that, it might be glitched out. Because um, obviously, I think the mission does make you get candy canes. Let me just double check. I'm pretty sure it does try and make you get candy canes. Ugh. I hate having to go all the way through it. Oh no, I could just do this, can't I? There we go. Right. And yeah, it does. As you can see, there it says candy cane. Oh no, it says garnish. I mean, Gartlands, which is lighting. Fish ornament and red balls. That's weird. How did I get candy canes on it? I have no idea how I got candy canes. It might be because, obviously, I got the whole tree done. And it's like, yeah, hey, we'll throw some candy canes this year for you. Right, so, anyway, Vamps. Did you want to try and get the elf kayak first or a bit later on? I can do that a little later on. I need yeah, to get that's the absolutely fine. decorations for the tree. Right, so I'm going to set down my um, tripod rods. <laughs> yes, it's going to be setting these down. <laughs> yeah, you do get candy canes as actual bait. Um, for I can't remember which fish it was now, but it is one of the monster fish. Are you spinner fishing? Yeah, to get the red balls, I would imagine, or... Red balls? To decorate the tree? No. See, I don't know how this works, so... <laughs> right. I don't do a lot of event stuff. Yeah, I know. Myself. This isn't anything... We've not come here to do any of the event stuff. Uh, for the red ball balls, you actually have to get the... Um, Krampus eel. Uh, you had to. Yeah. So that means you got to go for the actual gobies. Um, <laughs> yeah. It, it has to be at a certain location so you can get the gobies, the, cramp, uh, the crappies, and the bandits. I call them bandits because I can't pronounce the last name. And I've still got uh, the eel to get and the uh, of, uh, Krampus paro. Yeah, they're they're uh, from Mac and Macro Lake anyway. <laughs> can't pronounce the name. Uh, oh, this way you're going to tell me you didn't bring enough feeders on you then. I've got one feeder rod, so I'm good. Uh-oh. I'm good. You got Right, well, put your rod stand down anyway. Obviously, I'm going to show people um, like what I can do with the... Uh, s yeah. Oh, did you collect your snow on this map yet? Actually, no, I have not. No. Right. Well... Before you throw your first rod down, I'll show you where you can get your snow, even though it's pretty simple to find. I haven't collected mine yet from this location, so I actually have 11 on me. Um, oh, you disappeared from me. Oh, look, I see a present. So just in case, guys, because obviously I've not been able to really do much of a video. 
Yay! <laughs> Merry Christmas challenge has been complete by Vams. Woohoo! Ah, oh, there he is. He's glitched back in now. Seems to be lagging a little bit, guys. On the... I've noticed that on the PlayStation it does lag a bit for some reason. I don't know why these days. See, he's gone invisible again. Oh, yes, for me anyway. There you are. So it's just there in the palace now. This way you're going to say I'm glitching out for you as well, aren't you? Yeah, it does. Yeah, it's been a bit. You have to be a certain distance between each other so that way you can actually see. Yeah, so they've had a they've got a bug on that. It's like the tree. You get too close, it kind of glitches out like it's a really damaged old tree, and you get it far enough away, it looks really vibrant and full of life. You know, close. Oh no, it's lost all of its um, greenery. Oh look, it's all grown back slowly. <laughs> Vanish, expand. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Um. Right, so obviously from what I remember, obviously I need to make sure I'll get my right hooks on my rods now, I think it's definitely going to be a, well it's not going to be a 2 now is it? I'm going to be putting a free barbless on all of these, well free arcs I should say, barbless hooks for myself, because that's me, I'm very weird. You know, I'm going to go with spawn sacks to start with on all of them. And I'm going to make up a ground bait quickly so I can show you the ground bait guys. Because I know a few of you have been wondering. Uh... There we go, maxed it out. Mix that up. Bam, 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 bam. Come on, yeah, and yeah, I'm not a premium player, so obviously yeah, it doesn't do that. Now, obviously, as you guys may know, if I didn't have the slingshot, I was going to say catapult then. Don't know why. Um, yeah, if I have the, if I don't have the slingshot, you actually put in, I think, it's seven pound, not seven pound, seven ounces of the ground bait. I'm trying to think of the words, my brain doesn't want to work today. I put a certain amount in anyway. Obviously, as you can see, it is now added and equipped. So it actually takes half the amount as the actual. Well, it takes half the amount than what your hands would do. And that goes for any ground bait, you know. If you had ground bait in your hands, it'll be twice as much as what it is than as you see here on the thing. Now, obviously, as you can see, I'm hitting the button to aim. And nothing. You say can't can't aim with the catapult, unfortunately. It's annoying. So yeah, I can't aim with it. I'll see. Find this out. It's going to make no difference because we're not going to be using the snow on this. We're going to be using the snow actually in the feeders. That's for the crystal bird bot anyway. So I'm going to remove that. And of course, because I took it out of the slingshot, I lost it. So I've lost a bit, um, which I'm not going to be too worried about. So, so first things first is getting a few of these thrown out. If I remember rightly, we don't have to frame too far out. I think it's about. Let's see. What's the distance for me? Now yeah, about 60 feet out maximum, I'd say. Right. Let me just clip that. Put it back down. I have not done this on console in a while. <laughs> and like I said, guys, I'm going to be using my feeders. Just because I know I can. I know I'm going to get different distances on mine. Of course, I hit the wrong thing. Of course, it's brought it in a little bit. Ah, wrong way around. There we go. Now, I know I did this partly on my stream for... What did I do it for? I can't remember now. Which one? I know I did it on my videos. Right, have you got your... I was going to have you got your rods in, but unfortunately I've already got a bite on one of my rods. <laughs> of course, is it? it's going to be a normal trout. No, it was a bird bot. I haven't even started using my fireworks yet. Um, 
That was it. It was the um, Christmas uh, presents, you know, and the rewards for it all. Now, I know this feed rod is going to be the one that's going to take me the most time bringing a fish in. Well, that's taken line. I'm going to have to let that fish go because I'm not going to get it. Why do I have to have the wrong fish on my rods? I might be able to bring it in on that feeder. I'm not sure though. Eh, tension's fine, I don't care. So, I'm not going to be using my basic standard feeder rod because it doesn't work at the location. It's going to be too heavy of a fish. So, that one's going to be saved for a different day. Venomous Jack wants you to hit me with the snowball. <laughs> You should try a bit, Jack, with snowball. With the catapult? Jeez, that's going to be a bit of a challenge. Oh, no, my luck, I'll do it and I'll overshoot him. Unfortunately, because I'm not able to see him, it's going to be a bit more tricky. The PC is a lot easier. Um, I will give it a shot, though. Don't get me wrong, I can give it a shot. Let me just try and get these set up quickly. Oh, don't start going already. I ain't even stubbed my fireworks yet. There's Santa Claus. Right. Let me get one set up in my uh, thing. Right. Obviously, it, take, it doesn't take as long as it does with the hands, neither. So, hopefully I can get close enough. Obviously, I've got to try and get this firework gone down. <laughs> nope, unfortunately, Vamps has got a bite. Just a regular babot. See, that went too far. I tried and it went way too far. And I only hit the trigger for a little bit, but it went too far up. It goes up a lot quicker. What does for me, anyway? I'm not trying to get these fish already. I want to get other fish. Damn it. <laughs> This isn't the fish we're after. Oh, whoa, that's a lot of tension straight off the bat. Wow, this is definitely going to be a pretty strong burbot. Three, pa three pounds? Wow, how much tension do I have on this rod? For just a three pound fish? Anyway. I mean, number three. Oh, which one's my big owl? No, no. I mean, Big Al got snagged. Oh, for fuck's sake, he did as well. Oh, for Pete's sakes. This isn't going right. I'm. <laughs> oh, my. Well, at least people can know where to get bird bots if they need them real easy and what to use. It's not what I'm after, but. Right, somehow number three's got snagged. Oh, number one. Well, only numbers one slot. There we go. Right, let me just re set it back in. Now, let's just maximize it out. Right, enough of me messing around with this. Favorite time! <laughs> Now, fireworks are actually supposed to help yourself and other people to get in these fish while them fireworks are going off. Supposed to, anyway. They still do, which it proves it does. So I know I got one. That one is still hooked. I thought it was. It's weird, the buzzer wasn't even going off and yet it was still hooked. <laughs> it happens. Yeah, Lone Star is probably the easiest location to go to um, when it comes to them. Right, all right. 
that one's going to be hooked. And like I say, I'm using feeders for this place because obviously it's a lot easier to try and get these fish in. Um, especially once the fireworks have gone off. I'm, I'm a bit surprised it's lagging as much as what it has been at times. Especially for PlayStation, it's weird. Okay, why have I got... This can't be a strong trout. Come on. There's no way. It could be the Lake Whitefish, but I doubt it. My luck trying to get it just never happens. So do we have a target fish in mind, or are we just... Any of the festive fish, uh, well, Christmas festive fish, the furry um, trout, the antler salmon, or the crystal bird, but obviously you have to put white snow, and you have to actually fish at a certain place for them. Um, but if you f throw a firework down, which you can only do at White Moose Lake at the moment, it will give a chance for your rod, or whatever, how many rods you got out, as long as it's got bait on, to get the Christmas fish here. Apart from the gobies, the um, crappies, and the bandits, uh, you have to go to actually specific locations for them. But you throw a firework down, and it doesn't just work for you, it works for everyone else as well. Um, Ah, no. Come on, fish. Come on. Got something on your float. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to reel one off my other feeders. I really... That's my float going off, anyway. The float will come in easy. The feeder won't. Come on, fish. <laughs> this is annoying. It takes a bit of time. Actually, I do realize I can do this. Hey, there you go, see? And I got a furry trout. A unique one as well, and no I wonder it took a bit of time. And because I'm using something a bit less than it, I'm getting three bars of experience. That's awesome. And vamps, they still have the glitch with the headlamps. They even have it yep. on the PC as well. I thought it was Wait, funny. A unique furry trout. What? Yep. That's because of the fireworks. Uh -huh. Yeah. You know, the antler salmon as well. Crystal burbot, you can only use the. It has to be with the pure snow and the cut bait. But yeah, that's how you get them here. Um, like I say, you just send off a firework. I usually try and do it so I help, not just myself, I help others as well. That's why I'm with Vamps for doing it today. Um, anyone who's actually done this before will know exactly what we're doing. Ah, come on, no, no. Oh, I need to bring that in, don't I, but... Dang it, let me just put it about... And straight away, that's bringing in the fairy trout. Bye, mate. Now, I know you could just try and use all the fireworks in one go, but if you space them out, obviously it'll help you get your fish. And obviously, nah, it helps everyone else out as well. Um, so, because obviously, between us, we've got more than enough to try and get all these done. I know I've got a bit of a head start on it, but at least it'll help us try to get them done as well. Uh, the only one we can't help each other out really on is the fireworks, unless I've used all mine up and got the help, Santa's helper done, then I can pass you some more over. Um, but usually if we wait about a minute or two after the, for the first firework, yeah, see? What is it? It's that one. There you go, Vamps. That's what one look like. Oh wow. Very uh, furry. Uh, it looks like a you know, dog could be you know what this fish has been eating dogs again. Dang it. It's been eating mold. Mold bread. Um but yeah. Have you been feeding the moldy bread again? Well, you know, Christmas events were around at the time. 
I mean, Halloween events were around at the time, so eh, it's not a problem. Oh, for all sakes, am I getting... Um, I found the easiest spot with laws is to your left aim. Yeah. Um, I've not been able to get them, um, the crystal bird box with laws at all. I don't know if there's a specific law you have to use for the crystal bird box. If it's normal bird box, it's absolutely fine. But crystal bird box, I know you have to use um, pure snow in the feeder. And you do just literally aim for around here at this area. And you should have a high chance of getting your crystal bird bots around here. Um, but yeah. Ah, not another one. I've only just launched this one in. Dang you. At least it's my feeder, so it's not too bad. I'm going to feed my float, so my float rod should be fine. And yeah, this float's really got its drag up, as you can see, guys. And these fish are eating all of my spawn sacks. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Right. I'm now going to use my firework. Time to light it up. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Sorry, I'm using mine. You don't need to use yours. <laughs> Too late. We both did. <laughs> yeah. Oh, well, it's fine. Lag, I hate it. Oh, look, I put it down and then it's. I hate when it does that. <sighs> I swear they've changed the setting for this then as well at the same time because. This... I'll wait, I'll wait, I'll wait a minute before I've set another one off. Um... Wow. I bet that was a lot of fun getting them bird bots back then because they would have just been. Well, very new at the same time as the game came out for PlayStation. Well, the free version, I should say. Um, the paid version it was out a bit sooner than that, I think, if I remember rightly. But it's kind of funny how they hide a few of the um, challenges as well. It's like, break uh, so many reels in a row. Break so many rods in a row. So you can't catch a fish at all if you break one reel. You've got to break the next reel to get it done. If you don't, you've got to start the challenge all over again. Breaking the reels is actually one of the easiest challenges. Breaking the rods. Um, I think you have Not to so use um, a law. Have a heavier law than the rod itself. And then you'll break it real easy. I don't know. I've got to test and try it. But at least I've done at least one of each. <laughs> I've done a video. Uh, just have to do more than one in a row. And how many you actually have to do altogether. Oh my god. This one's fighting. So this is definitely going to be... Trophy or unique or whatever it is. Dang, this one's actually fighting back. Am I gonna have to just use float rods? This is not fun. And I usually bring piking on this. <laughs> I think it's no. Yeah, I've got. Oh, did I leave my two best feeders back at? I think I left my two feeders back at the base. Not back at home. Come on, just reel in. I hate the lag. Come on. There we go. And it is a burbot. That is going to be a heavy burbot. Trophy for as much. Wow, that lag is bad. You'd think on PlayStation it'd still be fine without the lag. It's not. Hey, you got trophies as well. And I got a splake. Right, I know I'm definitely not, my firework's not working anymore, so I'll have to set another one off for us. But yes, I am going to try, you know, I'm going to go with a, my Brutus for a minute. Kind of mix it up a little bit. I'm going to put a bit more length on that. Had it from St. Croix's Lake. <laughs> 20 inches for St. Croix's Lake. What? Why would you do that? Because I'm insane. Oh, 
I'm glad you usually want to do PC because at least then I know it's not lagging as much. But wow, I'm surprised the PlayStation is lagging as bad as what it has done for the fishing. I guess they're trying to make people go to the PS5 so they're making the games almost unbearable to play at times. Stupid reasons. There we go. That should be one of them. Ah, yes. Yes. I've got another fish. Yeah. Yes. I remember last year they really took really quickly. I don't remember them being this slow at taking the baits. So they may have nerfed the fire, how the fireworks worked, but. I remember the fireworks did work. They did work. Dang challenges. Come on. Oh my god. Maybe we should just use floats all around and stuff, feeders. Seems to be having a hard time with my feeders today. But I know what he got. Yeah, so do I. Where's my antlers? Who sneaked my uh, vamps? Have you been cooking up my antlers again? God dang it! Sorry, I just, I just, um, I had to eat it. Ah, uh, I don't know. I've been trying to get them antlers ones for ages. It's going to be a bit of a slow one, guys, today. I think, but we've got plenty of time in the world to try and get this challenge done. Um, hmm. well, I know if you'd you know have, me. uh, I see food and I eat it. <laughs> yeah, we all see food we eat. I know what the real one is, just the rod one. I've, I figured out how I'm supposed to do it, but I'm gonna do a few different tests, see which one works better. Um, Real ones are pretty easy. It's just exactly the way you describe having a better rod and line than the real. I'm just trying to, and you put it on was it zero drag? Have the fish take the line, literally completely take the line, and it will just destroy the reel completely. Um, obviously, make sure there's no tension on the line, and you'll be fine with the real ones. Um, it's the rod ones, which I just want to test and make sure that I can find a perfect way to help people get it done. Um, They really changed this cha this one completely because you... oh, don't tell me they're going to want certain fireworks for this one. Oh, let's see. What do you mean my rod snagged? How did this one snag? Oh, for fuck's sakes! There we go. Right there we go. Unsnagged you. Back and you go. Oh, you're using the firework, okay. Let's see if either of us two are lucky at getting a fish. Ooh, almost threw my thing out. <laughs> it's one of them things where it's a bit of a long journey, guys. It did have that nose. No, unfortunately, it didn't have the actual antlers. It was just the normal Atlantic salmon, unfortunately. Um... They are really uh, noticeable. These fish are really not wanting to bite. I kind of want to blame the lag on this. Let's try again. Duck for cover! If they've actually changed the sense for this, I'm going to be really annoyed. Because I could have done this last year, and I decided not to do it last year because I wanted to do a video for it. Oh my god! <laughs> Have all of this all we've caught so far is one, maybe two. This is not fun. This is not funny game. Come on. If someone turns around and says, oh, you're supposed to do it at night time now instead, I'll be like, what? <laughs> what? Are they kidding me? This... Oh, 
I'm guessing Vamps actually finally got one in. No, I'm just recasting. Ah, I'll wait till you've recasted. Um, this is going to be a bit weird that it's not getting any fish biting on. Let's, let's change up the firework. How about that one? Right, you recast it? Yep. Let's try it now. You got the trophy collector done. <laughs> I'm surprised. Oh, I was saying that mine should mostly be more feeders than anything else, but. Oh, come on, fish! <laughs> this is terrible when it doesn't want to do it. Yeah, it's supposed to. That's the problem. I don't know if they've nerfed it, though. Because obviously I know when they brought up the new map, I think it was the Amazon one, they've had a load of problems. And obviously, like I said, the ground bait is bugged out. And I just have a feeling they've actually bugged these fireworks out now by the looks of it. I actually placed that in the water! <laughs> <laughs> I placed it in the water! <laughs> oh my god, don't... So we're just gonna you know what I could try doing? Boat. <laughs> well, I was hoping that we will use the boat to try and get our um, antler fish, but this is... Re They've got to have changed something with this, because this is not normal. By now, we would have had at least one bite each. Yep. So they've changed... Oh, I should have tested this before. I understand promising that we're going to be doing this. Well, we're still going to try and do it. Um, unless someone knows the reason why they're not actually biting now for some stupid reason. i try changing up. Uh, had something, but... Oop. No, I could always change, change my bait. Change my position. Well, the jukebox was, is absolutely fine. I remember the fireworks being uh, about the same amount of time, to be honest. Um, it just fired a few up and that was it. It could be they've changed the duration, which is why it's playing up for, but... Either that, they're making it that it has to be closer to the new year. And that could be a reason. That's the point on on. There's me being here. On about it. Now, I had started with, was it, 63 fireworks, something like that? Set off seventy, so it's it's counting. And yeah, this is definitely not going to be nice. This is going to be horrible, and yep, I can imagine it is. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Can we kill the fish now or later? Mm. Cause yeah, this is because even so. I don't know if I, even if Amps was in the um, menu, I'd see his name above his head as you would on PC. So I think they've really changed and mucked something up on the sentence here for the console players. This is stupid because usually I'd see Vamps even if he was in the lobby bit. Oh, see, I know he's standing around hereish. I just I oh. moved. I'm behind you. Jeez, oh, no wonder. Okay. Oh, that one actually stood there that time. It looked like it almost glitched through again. Why do I think they're going to say, oh, it's got to be night time, not day time now for these? Now, there's a possibility that they want it to be more night time than day time. And there's only one way, one way really of finding out, and that's going to the night. But I want to try and catch a few more fish before I fast forward to night time because it does cost a bit to go to the next day. Um, but 
Yeah, well, at least by doing this, guys, at least we're testing it for you. So you guys can see and tell what's actually going on and if they <laughs> have changed the um, conditions you have to meet to be able to do it. And it looks like they've changed the conditions. Possible. Well, the ground bait, it seems like they changed the conditions. The only way the ground bait works the best is if it's on a peak time during its day or night period. Night period it works a little bit better. Which again, if they've changed it, they should really mention that they've changed how they have it done, really. Um, you know, because obviously most of us who played it beforehand, like myself, and obviously Venomous Project Jack, from what I can tell, he's played it for quite a long time, so he's done most of these challenges anyway. Um, and maybe a few other people out there who may be watching who aren't in the comment section. You guys may have done these challenges already. And yeah, usually, as. I can definitely say you have a firework going out and literally all your lives will be going off during or after the fireworks just finished and so far I can see nothing um, all you have to do is cast about 60 feet out minimum was I think about 40 and you'd have the fish bind feeders or floats don't really matter the um, height or the depth of the leaders and yeah, they'll be taken and bitten and gone. Obviously, we're not having that success, so I think they've changed the conditions. <sighs> Which is not going to be a fun thing to try and figure out now. That's going to make me bang my head against a brick wall. <coughs> Which I usually do quite often. I must admit. Um... Let's see, if mine doesn't go off, well, I've... Yeah, um, I know with Fishing Planet and Fisherman Planet, the Fishing Planet, which is the paid version, uh, still has the old version of the Christmas event. Obviously, the free-to-play version, which we're on, uh, the, just the Fishing Planet, they changed a few different uh, events, uh, added, obviously, quite a load of new maps and added a few extra events. So, they're supposed to still have the same stuff. Well, this one's supposed to have the same stuff as the Fisherman Fishing Planet, um, with only odd few differences, maybe as in the fish being at a location, or maps. Um and obviously level skills but last year it was exactly the same on the whole fireworks for catching these fish and so far it's it's uh, seems like they've changed it and conditions to be met which is not exactly a great thing so it's possible well I'm saying that we're on a peak time and we're still not catching that shows how annoying it is. Um, see, I'm supposed to be getting salmon. I'm not catching salmon at all. Um, I'm catching mostly burbot than anything else. And burbot's not supposed to bite on... Um, as you can see, it's not supposed to be biting on the um, spawn sacks. Yeah, it is. <laughs> So maybe I'll have to go down to small minnows and see if that will work for this salmon one, but Yeah, obviously the trap's different as well, but it's kinda weird that I'm getting bird bot on spawn sacks. I obviously fish do bite on other things than the preferred baits it says, but it's been a little bit no, I do not want to leave. It's been a little bit finicky and I'm getting a little bit peeved. Okay, you wanna play hard game I'll give you pain hard so if Amps is now doing that I'm gonna try and do this while he's doing that if not I might have to fast forward to night time let's see if that's gonna work because not it means this whole fishing experience is almost a bust because yeah. they've changed the sentence and it's annoying because 
me re get this rod back in because I think this one's stuck. No. It's in the minimum requirement. Got a bit far. Because I know in the past when I've been fishing around this time, I'll still get like the decorated fish or some of the special fish just from spin fishing. Well, they don't have the decorated not, fish. It's not one. all the time, but yeah. Um. Ow. Oh, and I'll read about you. Yeah, I'm just getting regular burbot. That's all I'm really getting. I think they've changed that it has to be at night. I think they may have changed the way it has to be at night. It's possible. Which it's is very, very annoying. So I'm gonna I'm gonna fast forward my time to see if that makes a difference. Either that they may have changed the distance I've got to be. Um let's see what <clears throat> comment was that was. Uh, people complain about the paid version not updating. Uh, the cause of them not updating is because Fishing Planet has to release the updates to the people in control of the paid version mm -hmm. so I've got to reread that one again because my brain just went completely brain dead after I read it right. people complain about the paid version not updating yeah I do agree I do complain well I haven't complained but I'm a bit annoyed that the paid version even though for white moose lake you had to pay for it as a DLC even though the free version which obviously we're on you didn't have to um, you do have to do a bit, quite a bit of grind as you do as the old other version, but the other version is classed as being a premium player. Whereas this, they've got it where a non-premium player doesn't make as much experience as a premium player does. And obviously, for this version, you don't get bait coin for free as you do with the paid version of the game. Well, that and they also have other um, yeah. fish that are not found. They have one on different this lake, particular version, and, and a, a few different fish. lake, but. Yeah, there's, it's just one lake which isn't on the free version, and there's a, extra fish on a uh, few other lakes. But this, the free version, has more lakes. Um, so I can agree on that part. Um, mm -hmm. Hold on. Uh, the cause of them not updating is fishing plan has not has the cause of them not updating is fishing plan has to release the updates to the people in control of the paid version. Honestly, mm. I think it's more or less the hype of the free version is bigger than that mm. of the fisherman because not not a lot of people are getting the fisherman because you don't get all the you don't other get all the other stuff as you do with this one, which is annoying because if they put the version in that, you just get probably people going back to it because obviously now one fact that I know there's a huge difference on which makes it easier on the fishman is you only need 10 players for a sport event on the fishman planet which means you can enter the sport events and you can reset your character from the start and you still keep your DLCs on the fishman the free to play version you can't reset your character so you're stuck with your character no matter what which is kind of annoying because you can do one on one but not one on the other now I know if people muck up they usually want to restart and that's it, it's fine. But yeah, you know, I can agree that, you know, the paid version in all honesty is underrated. Now I think the reason why they brought it out as a free version is because they didn't make so much and they needed more people to play it. So they thought, well, how are we gonna get more people to play it? We'll bring out a free version, but with it being the premium as the, you know, currency they'll get money from, and they will just up the free to play version, which is a way I think they've done it so I'm a bit annoyed they've done it that way they could at least give you know people who've paid for it oh we're going to give you the free map and you can do whatever you want you know updating the old version well I'm going to say old version but the paid version the actual paid version of the game they could have still updated that and still have this one updating as well even if they says right the people who've paid for the actual game they get to test it a, you know a month or two or maybe even three months beforehand before the free to play players get it I think that would mean people may want to buy the you know paid version of their actual game 
but you know it's a uh, I can't really Level, speak for level them, 43 on but... um, SOD Arch or Sod Arch um probably Sandra Baggersy Level 43 where do you recommend me fishing I hate that load. I hate Sandra Baggersy though that's the problem me it would be St. Croix just pike fishing and getting a load of cash um that or um <laughs> go to what is it san joaquin and go after the it really depends what the sturgeon there it depends because sturgeon you don't really make a lot of cash for yeah but i do though. know that it's experience that you can really get from the sturgeon more than the cash because a lot of there's quite a few people out there that will say that the sturgeon will is quite the experience and the cash that you get from it. Uh, but then again, but it depends if they've also got you have to be um, using barbless as well. Yeah, but it also depends if they've got a premium account or not. Because if you have yeah. a premium account, you get a lot more experience and a lot more cash. Unlike them, we don't. We don't have premium at all. We're playing it without premium, so anything we do. We are doing it without paying a single penny. Um, that's you see, obviously... that's kind of... Sorry to cut you off. Sorry, no, Jack. That's a little um, ridiculous because it's the same company. It's the same game. So that I whoever talked to you is obviously not very well adverse with the fishing planet to know that it's pretty much the same game. It's just different features on the two different games. Um. I want to, I'm going to interject on that one. Um, right, one, the person who may have spoken to you may be correct. It might be a different department, though, because I think somebody may have took over, because they may have gone, well, technically they may have gone slightly bankrupt, then someone took them on. That's the only reason why I'm saying that might be the reason why they're saying that for. Only reason why I'm saying that for. It might not be true. I think the paid, the actual paid gamer version, they were with a different company. Um, which is really annoying if it is true I can't say for certain I'm not going to say it is or not you know and yeah I do agree with you uh, Jack it is annoying that the people who paid for the actual game are stuck at being level maximum level 50 had to pay for Blue Crab Island and they've got no new areas the only one area they have is one different one which is near France uh, French, France France I can't remember the name um Somebody will probably quote me of what it Chris is River. and what it's called. Um, but yeah, I, I, me and Vamps really do understand. We have both versions. Um, obviously, like I said, we're playing on the free version because it obviously has a few extra updates. And we still do we do videos. Obviously, Vamps has done quite a lot more of the mission and story video. Uh, I'm going to say story in those missions um, on the free-to-play one so far. I am catching him, him up slowly <laughs> with it. But obviously, we both yeah. have different experiences of how we play the game. Um, so... What I might say might be different from him. What he says may be different from me. This stuff we do agree on, um, but some stuff we don't fully agree on, as you can tell. Um, but yeah, I we both understand that it's annoying that people have paid for the game are stuck being that Blue Crab Island is the maximum level, and I think max level's 50. You know, I feel kind of ripped off, but then again, I didn't buy the game when it first came out. I actually bought it when it was about, I'm going to say 20 quid or 20 pounds. So in some ways I'm getting a game which made the game the way it is now to be honest um, but yeah I am agreeing with you I'm glad to see that there are people who still play the paid the actual paid version of the game um, it's just yep. more people will I be playing I think if they were to, to I else, think it's more or less the hype with the free version because there's more maps yeah Um, is what is doing it yeah because um, yeah. you the highest I think you can get for the fisherman is like level sixty, I think. Uh, on so sorry, sorry. What was your question? <laughs> I was trying to read chat at the same time. I do believe that the highest level for the fisherman is level sixty. Fifty. Or is it fifty? It's fifty. Okay, it was. It's been fifty for a long time because Saint. Uh, Blue Crab Island is technically a level 54 on this game, but it's a paid version on the paid game. 
because <laughs> it's classed as a DLC. Yeah. Um, but yeah, the level cap is 50, if I remember rightly. Somebody can quote me wrong. I don't mind you quote me wrong, but I'm pretty sure it's level 50 from what I remember. Um, I might be off by five, but I'm pretty sure it's 50 because that's where it was years ago. A couple of years ago for this game, it was level 50 before they started adding new maps because I was just about hit level 50 and they went, here's the new maps. I went, bugger. Um, Anyway, let me just check. Yeah, my... because we just recently had the Africa map drop for. Well, we had Maku Maku and all that lot. All of them started to come out just about as I was about to hit level fifty at the time. I was like bugger. Um, right. Well, that was at I've the beginning quite of the year. Quite a lot of questions here in chat. That... Um, it's stupid that Saint Croix is like number one for money and experience. It is when you hit a certain level, you get a well. Obviously, when you pass a certain level, the amount of cash and experience gets less. Believe it or not, you still get a good amount. Don't get me wrong, um, but you have to use like barbless to really still keep a high amount of cash and experience coming in. Obviously, if you're using yep. the weaker rods, you're still going to make quite a lot of experience, but it does go down slightly. It's a small amount, and not a lot of people have noticed. I have noticed because I've, I've done quite a bit of testing on that part. Um, SFD, are you able to go to California? Uh, yeah, I'm level 43 with 200k. <laughs> nice one. Uh, one bottom rod. Uh, try fishing for sturgeon there. So yeah, again, what Vamp said. Try maybe fishing for sturgeon at um, the lake. You said. Um, hello, yeah, Stevie. Soon, Joaquin. Ray, um, depends on what type your best rods are. If bottom rods, I'd say sturgeon. I'm going to say that's Cali. You pronounce that. Um, Can you? Ca- <laughs> Shut up. Show off. <laughs> uh, yeah, I call Vamp show off all the time. If somebody says something and it's like, yeah, okay, right, sh- you're showing off now. Um, I will say people are showing off. Um, sorry. Um, if casting, I'd say salmon. Yeah, um, I know 42, but everyone has the, yeah, everyone does have different takes. As like I said, me and Vamps have different um, information or our own experiences. Um I could say, for an example, I hate mud water, but then Vamps might love mud water because of maybe fish from a catfish. Yeah, he he loves fish from a catfish, I think, Vamps does. I might be wrong on that one, but we're just giving that as an example. I hate mud water because I can't catch anything at mud water, and you'll see with some of my videos, I hate mud water, and I'll say how much I hate it. Um, you know, you'll see in one of the Vamps live stream, I was with him doing falcon lake and he was going out for the um outlaw fish now we spent i think it's like five videos trying to get the outlaw fish and we remembered it had to be a certain weather condition vamps had fished there and he had made more there than what i made at all i got one fish out of one of his live streams and that was it and i was having difficulty catching a single fish at falcon lake and i hate it on console pc i'm fine consoles i hate it um, so yeah, everyone will have their own different experiences. Yeah, it took and information like on the I games, wanted, and that is like honest. four or five videos or live streams yeah. for me to even get that outlaw. Yeah, it used to be it was just me. yeah, it's all right, uh, Jack. We understood you meant XP farm. Um, paid version is t- yeah, okay. Jack can confirm paid version is uh, top level at fifty. Um, what is the rank next to Peeps' names? Yeah, yeah, right. I'll, I'll answer this one real easy and I'll show you. Right. Obviously now, the level cap now is 80, if I'm not mistaken. I'll quote me wrong. You can quote me wrong. I'm pretty sure it's level 80 because of the rods. Now, obviously, as you see there, it says rank. When you hit the max level of the t- at the time of the game, every time you level up, it's classed as a rank level up instead of a normal level up. So you somehow get a bit more experience, I think. Or it's just basically your experience carrying on, but it's giving you a ranking. Um... I've seen people hit over a thousand because when it was level 50, when it was level cap, you've had people who literally had been fishing, see 558. So if their experience was still going up, you know, you can imagine their actual level would be now. Uh, So 558 plus 71, you know, would equal their actual level on the game. So that's how much they've been playing that game. You know, um, my hat's off to any person who's been playing it and still playing it today, you know, I know there's some people who have come back to the game after years and they're like, oh my god, it's so much changed. And they had been like level rank 100, but they were level 50 and, you know, hats off to all them players and hats off to everyone who's playing this game because, you know, I think the game's amazing. Obviously at the moment they've changed a few things and they do have a few bugs. Obviously we're experiencing them right now at the minute because we're not able to catch any of these Christmas fish at this lake, which is a bit annoying. We're going to test see if uh, night fishing might be a bit easier with fireworks, which yeah. we'll do in just a minute. Um, 
Let me just quickly catch up on. I'm already thirty messages. minutes into the night. I've changed. Uh, when you when you re I'm go I'm guessing that's supposed to be recalled the yeah recalled the levels. And when you level up, pack it that it turns into yeah basically the same thing I said. And her, welcome back, uh, KP. Hopefully you had a good night's sleep. Wow, half five in the morning there in Vietnam. Uh, oh, thank you, Vamps. Uh, Jack, I oh Jack, okay. Um, we <laughs> well, both Jack and I pretty much said the same thing. Yeah. To be honest. Um, I'm at rank five hundred and eight myself. Wow, Vamps. Two oh eight. Uh, Jack. This game just needs to fly fishing boats with f passages for. Uh, rod holders and book yeah um obviously as i will show you guys because obviously anyone who hasn't seen it um the newest dlc which they brought out actually has on this version i'm saying this now this version rod holders now if you have got the paid version uh i think it's the predator pack you can quote me wrong or not on this one um that boat actually has a two rod holder stand now there was a rumor a very, very huge rumour that on the paid version you could actually have another player with you. Yeah, I've checked every single boat, I checked every single DLC, it does not say you can hold another yeah, player. Yeah, we've even tried it ourselves and we yeah. can't even do it. We can't even find the boat that's supposed to be able to hold another person, that's supposed to be on the paid version. Um, and it would be nice to have another person with you, you know, if they're a friend and you have them on your friends list and you accept them, maybe even you're on the boat and you say, you know, you look at them as they're on the dock and you say, come on my boat. They might have to pay, we'll say, what, half the amount it is to actually, you know, be on their boat. Or, you know, because they're a friend, they don't pay anything. Yep. I think it's because they want people to still pay for using a boat. Which is kind of stupid in all honesty. But, you know, they could try and maybe set something up to say, you know, you want a friend to join you on a boat. That's absolutely fine. You know, you could say, they can't drive the boat, but you can. Or you could say, right, you can drive my boat. And that's it, but you know, they haven't allowed that. I think it's because people might not want other people coming onto the boat and riding it wherever because obviously there's no collision with the boats. So, you know, hopefully they may work on something like that, but I'm not going to guarantee it to be honest. Um, but yeah, the Congo Discovery Pack I, that's the only boat I know that actually has the two rod holder, unfortunately. Um, which is fine maybe for trolling I'm not sure because I'm not sure how fast the boat goes um, I think it's like the bass boats is insanely fast you don't really need to, to go too well, fast really for trolling. on the paid version every single boat minus the bass boats has the rod holders and if you're going to troll it has to be under the speed of 10 because yeah, it will for... not let you go any faster than 10 miles an hour to stand up yeah i usually keep it at one because obviously with my bass boat it goes pretty fast and it will literally just not register because obviously my reel setup um it won't register that it's going either straight or slow straight so i have it at a speed of one which just literally just well i slowly. have the predator pack that you were talking about yeah i didn't really play so much it's... of the fisherman fishing planet to be honest i played it enough but not a lot yeah. Um, Vamps actually beats me on that one, and I'm still standing. Yeah, but I played more on the fisherman than I have on this one, even though I'm at a decent level for this. But yeah. now that they've dropped a new map, the max level being 75 now, oh. so it's yeah. And what's my markers over here for? Unique lake trout. Okay, no fish day. That's probably the pike. No fish data. Why have I got a fish data over there? No remember remembrance of why I've got it there for. I don't know. I really don't know. Why. What's the button for time? Aha! It was, it was square, square this whole time. I might have been getting it wrong. Right, I've got to go to the middle of the night to see if this is going to work for the fireworks. Right. Um. And hello. I'm going to guess the name's supposed to be Bag. Uh, bumper Boats. Yeah. It would be interesting if they actually added something so you can actually... Um, Instead of clipping through each other, actually have actual physics. Yeah, uh, then you know people will be hitting into each other and it may damage someone's boat, and then you get people getting annoyed and wanting to play singles. You know, it's a catch-22 on that one. Um, but it would be interesting if they did do something like that. Um, people would get annoyed. You, you could see the complaints, can't you? Oh, they destroyed my boat. I was like, okay. 
but yeah, I it would be funny to have bumper boats in. I would say. Um, but this. Well, I think we just now answered the question with the answer. No, we haven't. This is a bird bot. Dang it. I thought I would go answer that question about the... Uh, does it go into night time? I'm going to help you get with the Christmas fish with fireworks. Answer that question? No, so far. Um, Dang you, Santa. You should make sure the fish are giving pest. Darn thing. All right, let's me try it out. Boom. There we go. Oh wow, that one went off. That's my float rod. Let's see. That's the brook trout. Come on, are we gonna get these fish? Come on. Nah, I want to throw the rods in the water now. <laughs> I think they've... I'm going to kill them for that. Um... <laughs> you want them to Welcome jump on a boat so you can push them overboard. <laughs> That's nice. Uh, be right back. What's the sling do? Uh, that one... Uh... Right, what the sling shots do is they actually uh, make your ground bait go a lot further. Um, actually, can I? Ah, oh, no! I don't want to hit that button. Do I have it here? I do have it here. So, as you can see here, I've already got it set up. Now, obviously, if you put ground bait in your hand, it would go 65 feet. I'm not sure what the metric system is um, for it. On distance, um, but with a slingshot, the max it can go, and I'll actually show you this. Well, as you can see, it says there in the bottom right, uh, it's uh, 114 feet. That's at max. So you'll basically be throwing bait into the water, um, and obviously you use less ground bait in the slingshot than you do your hand, and it is a little bit quicker. As you can see, that's spinning up pretty quick, and it's done. So it is a bit quicker doing it this way as well. Um, unfortunately, doing this up close to someone. No, oh, I actually hit him that time. <laughs> so it's the easiest. You have to be really quick. Um, it's easier to use the hand, be inside them and throw it in and that's it, done. Um, <laughs> uh, welcome back. Um, but yeah. Really? You're launching snow into my back. Unfortunately, you can only do it one per person. You can't do it to the same person over and over again. Because if I, to, you know, you've got to do, what was it? I think it's a hundred altogether. Uh, you can't do it to just one person. You've got to do it to a hundred different people. Oh, thank you very much. Make my light, night sky light up. Wee. Um, just like a firework. Where's my baba going all over the place? Um. You can then light my farts and it makes it go in the sky like a firework. Oh, no, I should bend over, shouldn't I? When I just start launching them out my rear end. Uh, there we go. Uh, I finished. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Oh, I do dear. apologize. Um, please don't hate me. I'm going to try changing it to a different base. See if that might. Well, shouldn't make any difference to change my bait but let's try something different let's see if it attracts the different ones well, I'm about to but... try another bait that I have that's left over from last year uh oh another one the gingerbread man yeah I don't think that would really work for Christmas well, I'm saying that it wouldn't be a bad idea it, I do it have... tells you that it does what the salmon and that lot the furry trout, the antler salmon, it doesn't say that for them. It says for the gobies, the bandits and the crappies, but that's more at Lesney, uh, Lone Star, Emerald, 
sandbags, yeah, baku other baku, ones. and all that lot. DMX. Yeah, unfortunately. Um, yeah, well, hopefully, all this information is helping. Obviously, if you need any more information, we do actually have quite a few videos. We're back I to. do believe they actually fixed the bug. What do you mean, fix the bug? On the skin. Not during the daytime. Nighttime they have. Not the daytime though. Because I, I showed you. Really? I showed it at the start of my stream. Yeah. If you Are go you to sure? someone at the daytime, guys, and obviously, I'm not trying to be. Um, I don't know what Racist. Word to use. That would be the word, but I was trying to be a bit of a thingy word. Yeah, it's... You'd go up to someone. Now, if they were white skinned, they would actually turn out to be a different color, or darker colored skin, I should say. Um, which kind of makes that the nighttime, you know, you seem fine, but it doesn't make you darker. So I think they still have the slight problem. But during the daytime, you go up to someone and it would change the color of their skin. Um, not being horrible in any way, guys. I do apologize if it sounds like it. I'm not. I'm just saying that is still the bug that's still in the game that I've no we've noticed. And it looks like fireworks make no difference what time of day it is. Dang it. Um, so All right. Hang on. This is going to be a bit Let's try this. Um, because Jack is saying, did you guys try casting out after you light the fireworks? So let me reel in both of mine and then we can try this. Well, I remember you have to be before you cast it out. Yeah, if they've changed it to that, then that's going to be a bit annoying. <laughs> Launch a firework now. Cast out. Um. Yeah, I bet we will try it. All right. Well, we're happy to test anyway, so we can see if it does or doesn't. Yep. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm going to set mine down. God dang. Go on, you. And a unique burbot. Unique burbot, nice. <laughs> why? Why unique burbot? <laughs> That's not a bad price, actually. Eight hundred and two, um, cash. Right. So nope. you've set your firework off. I've now cast it, even though it's still going at the minute. Let me see when that finishes. Is that finished? Yeah. I guess it has. Right, let's see. All right. So both of mine are in. Well, I had a slight hit on that, but it just gave up straight away. Like not going to it. Might be because my laser's not too long for it. But we'll test it. Um. Um. It could be a bad thing, because that's going to mean that your um, stuff is going to break at that point. It could break. Okay, right. There we go. Um, let's see. Now, this is the reason why. And I got a normal Atlantic Salmon. No surprise there. Um, so, at the minute, it doesn't seem to make any difference when you have the fireworks going off. They just seems to be a pain at the minute. Let me just add some more length. Um, but yeah, guys, like I said, we both have channels. Obviously, Vamp's channel is in the description. If you want to go check out his channel out at the same time, you can do. He is live streaming this, as you know, or as we speak. Um, nope, I'm if not. If you are enjoying the stream, on, you are or aren't streaming? I'm not. You know, oh, <laughs> so it's me who's just streaming. But he does have quite a few videos. And he may do a video about this um, at a later date. But yeah, go check Vamp's channel out. Um, obviously, you can check out my stuff. Obviously, I do quite a load of different videos like Vamp's does. Uh, you know, if you're enjoying the stream so far, hit the like button. If you haven't already, please do subscribe. You can also do the same for Vamp's. And also, ring the bell notification or change the sense for the bell notification so you know exactly when we're streaming or when we do updates on games or what we play. Um, yep. Especially if you're enjoying this so far, and I hope you guys are. Uh, if you do still have any questions, obviously we're still going to be playing this for quite some time, so you can put it in the in the live chat. We'll try and answer the, these questions as best we can. We're going to try and test out any theories you guys may have as well about you know how we can catch these fish because obviously they've changed. They must have changed the algorithm, or there's a bug in the algorithm, so that's why we're not catching these fish. Sadly, I was hoping we'd be catching these a lot more. All I've caught so far is one. 
<laughs> Fine, yeah, I know Vamps hasn't caught one. one yet, but I've caught one. One fairy trout. I'm not happy about that. Um, but yeah. Uh, on. He didn't just hit you in the back. He got you in the back of the neck. Oh, that was cold. Oh, 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 oh that's freezing. Oh, 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 I'm chilly already. Um, let's just quickly grab this one. God, I'm trying to keep up on chat at the same time. Uh, good luck, everyone. Happy fishing. Uh, take care, everyone. Well, you as well, Ark. Hopefully you are enjoying yourself and taking care. And hopefully you had a great Christmas uh, or happy holidays. Uh, just in case we don't catch you, if you are leaving uh hopefully you have a happy new year obviously we should still do maybe a stream near the new year time don't quote me i do have something set up for the new year unfortunately it's not fishing planet it's something completely different so if you are around for that event for the new year's eve for the new year's day for us in the uk i do have something that should hopefully work to celebrate the start of the new year it's going to be something different i hope and hopefully you guys will enjoy it um did you guys try casting out Oh, you yeah, said that one. Uh, is it bad if that meter thing for your rod or reel? Yes, it is very bad, as Vamps did say. Um, depending which one, because obviously we have it so we have it professional so we can see it now. Unfortunately, I'm on, well, we're both on uh, PlayStation. If I was on PC, I could show you exactly which bit I would be on about because I'd uh, show. If any of them are hitting red, especially on the line, it will snap the line, means you'd lose the hook, the bait, and if it's a feeder, you could lose your feeder cage or your sinker. Uh, if it was for a float, you could use, lose the float rod. Now, if you've got one which you cost Bitcoin, bye bye. You now got to set up a new, yeah. uh, the whole rod for it. Now, saying that, there is a challenge for reel breaker and rod breaker. Now, if you get the red, either in the reel or the rod part, and you want to break the rod and you absolutely fine with it, unfortunately, it's gonna, you're going to lose out on cash at that point. I'm going to warn you now before I say the rest of it. You, there is a challenge to break five rods in a row and five reels in a row. Best suggestion is use the weakest, well, the cheapest reel you can get, which is the mini spin. If you can break five of them in a row, that's only going to cost you two thousand five hundred rods. I'm not sure what the cheapest one is, uh, but it depends on which one you want to do. Because obviously, once they break, fully break, you have to go throw them in a bit. Um, so there is a challenge. To actually break five rods and five reels, uh, it depends on how much you want to pay. You know, you can either go for a really cheap way around it, or there's the long way around it. Now, obviously, I've shown you guys exactly what happens with the rod breaker and reel breaker. Exactly what happens to your rod and your reel. And you know, I was like, oh, maybe I can fix these. Nope. <laughs> Dang it. Um, because obviously, in real life, if you had your rod and reel completely break you might have a chance of fixing it in real life but nine times out of ten you may go well that can't be fixed because that's completely broke that's got to go in the bin and that would happen reels you might be able to find a you know a replacement part for it and fix it but they don't do replacement parts on the game unfortunately um so yeah like fam said it is a good thing but in a way there is a hidden chance to do them unfortunately i'm not on the um, PC I would be able to show you them too because unfortunately I haven't done them on the P PlayStation and I'm not going to risk breaking the rods and reels on this version of the game yet um, that's that durability time on 10 times uh, 10 time game time after lighting the fireworks or used it before ok uh, based and chilling fish oh I mean what's up you know, my float rod really does like going off, but the rest don't. Why is this one I access? Burbot are buying everything on my rod. Okay, right, I'm changing this, because Burbots are eating my spawn sacks like anything. I've had enough. No, nope, not having it. No, nope, no more. Let's go for, I don't know, something stupid. How about artificial salmon eggs, even though that's exactly the same sort, but it's artificial. It's not real, it's fake. <laughs> they don't like them. <laughs> on fish <coughs> right let me re actually let me recast all these i'm going to set the firework off and i'm going to try recast and see what happens with mine um well, we can try them uh i think I he's really i think learned. i know where he's talking about uh you try along the cliff when got them i had to cast other rocks sticking out at the bottom 
I think he's talking about kind of over on um, that way. I don't, I'm not. I'm not seeing what you're on about. Hey, where are you at? Where? You know, over this way. Um, when you're looking towards the other huts. Oh, casting out over. You're on about casting out from down that end, over to that bit. From what I remember, that was just for the Northern Pike, though. You know, I do have two. I do yeah. have a marker that's over the. Actually, you know, I'll move my rod stand because I do have my rod stand here. You know, we'll try this. <coughs> might be the reason why they might be in a specific place, but I remember when I was trying to catch these normal fish, uh, normal fish, the Christmas. Uh, yeah, when you're uh, not event the... Christmas fish, I'm going to say. Hold on, why is this not placing? Place, place, place. Am I hitting the wrong button? I'm hitting the wrong button. I'm an idiot. Right, let me just uh, unclip that. So I'm trying to go through all this now at the same time. <laughs> uh, unclip that. Oh, there needs to be an easy way. I kind of want to hook up the <laughs> PC. Oh, he Mostly. was talking about over by where I was casting. On oh, that. he's on about the Burbot. Which we will test out in a minute. I should, well, I'll test out after I've tried to get these. Uh, see if I can get at least one of these um, fairies in that lot. Unless they put them all on the Burbot side. Which is a very possibility. Which I'll be very annoyed if they've done it that way. Um, hold on. They didn't put it that you had to have pure snow with them now, did they? I can't remember. Yeah, it's fair enough. That's almost the full length of my... Wow, that's almost the full length of my line, that one was. Ouch. Is that one still going off? No, it's finished now. No, I meant my... Uh... I meant my uh, bite alarm, but my bite alarm stopped. Yeah, it's definitely stopped. So I'll wait a moment, see if any of them go off. If they don't, I'll set a firework off again. Wow, they're not even anywhere close to the markers. A bit far away from it. Um, by the kayak, yeah, it was on about Jackson, about the um, Crystal Burbot spot that I know of. But yeah, I will be trying to fish for the Crystal Burbot, which is literally. Just as Jack says in the in the chat, uh, you obviously put some pure snow in your feeder. And you should get a bit of crystal bear bottle around there. Is it bite over No. Um, but we can always try to see if the um, fish do bite over this side as well. No. As soon as you're over it, I'll throw one down as soon as you've got nothing on. Oh, wow. Nope, that one's not going. That one is. Oh, now the other two are going off. Right, let's get you in. Tuck you in. Should be able to reel this one in fully before I have to go back to the other one. Come on. That is Spike. Just the fact they were all going off at the same time, I was like, oh my god, it might be hopeful. It's saying there's an off colored rock that you cast by. Oh, what, for the Crystal Burbot? Yeah. Oh, what am I doing? I can just... I'm not this. sure about what color you're yet looking for, though. Because most of them look rather like the same color, almost. 
because you have a mix of like crystal blues and brown. Like, Let me see. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I know. I know whereabouts the crystal bird bot is. It's not a hard one. It's just literally you have to have pure snow in and cast it out a bit. Um, you usually use your feeder more than anything else, and it has to be mostly small cut bait. You can use medium cut bait. But again, you still have you to have see. Snow. That's what I'm using on my feeder right now: a small cut bait in the pure snow. Pure snow. Yeah. Um, because that's why I remember catching mine up. Well, that's what I got marked on my thing for catching them. Um. Right. Let me just set mine up for this. I'll go just... Uh, feeder. Jack, what do you play on? Do you play on PC or do you play on computer? Oh, wow, that's too heavy. What? This is all too heavy for my... So that was optimal. This is insane. I've only got one rod. That's optimal. Too heavy. Too heavy. Wow. I seriously cannot cast that with that on. Are you kidding me? Did I bring a lighter? <clears throat> no. Undo that one. Right. Undo that. Me undo you and undo you. Put my cage. I was in. gonna say if you was were able to show us a screenshot as to which one it is, then we'd be able to figure it out, but that was too light yet, yeah, it's the only one I got for it. Dang it. Right, let's just try this anyway. If I remember rightly. If I remember rightly. For the bird it's about. Surprisingly enough, I think it's about there, unless that says float. Um, I could probably cast a bit further up, but. Should be in the right location. The bird bot, but I need to go a bit more further out then by the looks of that. I'm gonna have to reset that. Um, yeah, you can do that. Um, you can find Wesonator on 88 easily. Yeah, it means I gotta turn my console on. Uh, you have to give me a moment on that one then. Um, Or you can send it to me. It'll be on um, my name with um, TTV and YT in it. But either or, you know, you have a good pick that we can go by, then we can figure it out. I'm pretty sure it was just. Um, come on, you bearbot. Now they may have changed it again with the whole. I forgot me using my weak. One down there, dang it. Oh my god, going after crystal bird box as well. And... Where it meets the tree line, okay. On, is it the marker? Oh! I... Might be where I got I that marker might... up there for. I think I, know I might know where you're talking about, Jack. I think I might know where you're talking about. Come on, feeder. I know I should have used a different feeder. Um, tree line, odd colored rock. Why do I feel like that's exactly where that marker is? For some reason. Oh, 
tree lines over there, though. Or... I do have a marker out in that direction towards the tree line. I think that might be the spot then, but I'm pretty sure the crystal bed was supposed to be over here if I remember rightly, but let me get this fish in. Um, this is going to be a fight and a half. Because I'm using a basic feeder rod. To bring <laughs> it's going to be a burb up, but it's going to be a 9 1. Come on. It looks like a big toe sticking out. <laughs> <coughs> yeah. Okay, you fishy fish. If you've got the uh, Lake of Whitefish, I'm going to be annoyed with you. Because technically that's the only thing, fish I need to get for this place, but... Uh, dang, I thought that was my fish then jumping out of the water, but then I noticed your bob. I was like, dang it. I think I have a lake trout. Again. Um, I think I have a marker, um, a reference marker for the whitefish, though. I think. You said the lake whitefish is what you need to get. That's the only one I need to get, but I'm not worried about it. I was just saying, if you've got it, yeah. also, I'll be annoyed because I've gone to the location where it's supposed to be. <sighs> a trophy bird, but what I'm getting is. Dang, trophy's right. Let me move the thing that I've got on my rod because obviously this is not going to be the greatest rod to be using out of the feeders. With the snow, I forgot I needed to move that one over, didn't I? I don't care if I waste that bit. Ground bait is just ground bait. Right, let's go up to here. Right. Light one, optimal, good. Ground bait. Optimal, good. <sighs> No, I'll keep it in the wrong button. Right. Um, well, hold on. I've got... What am I thinking? I've got boat. I've got my boat and I. Hold on. Right. Obviously, I don't have to pay for a lot. My boat and thing, because obviously I have... My license. Let me just double check out here. Because I could check the trees at the same time. Oh, oh there was a splake. Because uh, that's not the spot I was, would be thinking. Where's my... Mark? I don't know. Where's my marker gone? I have a marker out here somewhere. Where is it? Where's my marker? I had a marker out here somewhere. Where's it gone? Oh, there it is. It's in front of me. I'm an idiot. No, it is a marker. Because I did have a marker here for some reason. Now, it could be... That could be the reason why. Because, um, obviously, that, for me, over there... Cause you're mentioning I'm going to send you a mark. Because you mentioned a toe-shaped rock is over there. Yep, I just sent you a mark, so that, what? that'll help you with the what? white fish. Oh, right. Um, I don't know even how to even go to the shed marker. Because I, can't, I, I can't... had a mark. Yeah, I can't see the, white, uh, the shed marker. It says it's about markers and I can't see shed markers. I also need to get rid of an old one. Um, what do I have there? You know, I'll get rid of that one. See if it gives me enough room for the... Yeah, see, I can't see the... Alright. Send so mark on the last fish? No. Yeah, I can't see your marker. It says it's shared, but I don't see it. Oh, there it is. Retrieve marker. Yeah. Ah, okay. So it's there. Show off. 
I can show off. I'll leave that there for now. See, for me, yeah. I don't know why I've got this marker out here for, though. There must be a reason why I've got a marker out here. But yeah, there's a tree line there and a toe over there. So unless this is the, this is the spot he's... Dang it. I haven't done this on my phone in a long time. Um, so this is, this is the spot you're on about. Um, Jack, then obviously I marked it for a reason. I can't remember why. Um... Read what it says after you decorate the tree. It says something about crystal bird bot and sn snow ground bait, I think. Okay, hold on. Because I'm pretty sure that's how I found out about it. Right, since Antler. Yeah, right, so complete Christmas tree ornaments and decorate a Christmas tree. A white moose lake, right? Light fireworks, have fun and continue your winter holiday since antler antlered salmon, crystal burbot, and furry trout have already reached these waters. These fish can be attracted with snow ground bait, so stock up on snow and set off for White Moose Lake to have some fun, merry adventures. And you can continue fishing for Krampus until the holiday ends. So maybe we'll go have snow in our Feeders at the same time as getting the fireworks going off. Hang on, that's the description it says in the um, decoration. Decorate the Christmas tree. Collect tree ornaments. Decorate Christmas tree and White Miss Lake. Hmm. Because obviously I'm the one who's got it completed, and I don't think it says it for you. It just says you know put stuff on the tree, but decorate the Christmas tree is what it says. Um, so yeah. So maybe we've got to put snow in with it then. Maybe that's the reason why we're failing so ter well. I say terribly. Uh, go there. Uh, I keep hitting the wrong spot. Right. I don't know. You travel. No, not fast time it. Yes, I want my boat to return to the position it was in. Right. Well, I'm using the pure snow. I guess my problem is is I don't have all the um different pieces of the decorations. Well that shouldn't stop you from getting the um fish though from what I know. You shouldn't do. If that's the reason why you're not able to get them then I'm a bit annoyed about that. Well, not you, I mean at the It's a bit of, it's a bit annoying because I didn't realise that might be one of the cases. Um, so we'll try this we'll try these different spots I'll throw one out there as well just in case it's over there I'll put in two different spots and I'll set a firework off see if that works <laughs> snow with fireworks let's see if that helps um Unfortunately that's as far as my feeder will go or my best feeder will go. But I was trying that location cuz I remember that location. I know it's supposed to be around there. Um And just another normal burbot trophy, though. Um, you know, we'll try and see if I can get this out even further than what I've got it. I think the reason why I can't get it out any further, apart from it being clipped, I might be able to get out further. Pretty sure it's about there then. Cause I think that's the spot you speak about where my marker is. And I didn't clip it. Let me just put it there. Let's clip it at 200. There we go. 
it'll reset itself back down, it always does. I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be out there because you're supposed to go from because that rock looks like a toe. There to that tree line. I'm pretty sure that's what it's supposed to be. Oh look at you with the bass bow, I don't know. Vamps with his bass bow, I don't know. Um I say I ain't done this in a while. Well, it's been a year anyway since it was last out, but I remember just doing that. Other option I could quickly check it out to see what actually video show, but it'd be a bit annoying really trying to check them out because they may have changed the information since last time. Just so I have a visual if not I've got to turn my PC on. Because obviously I'm watching this through my phone. Um Oh, okay. Thank you, um, Steve. Thank you, Steve. So let's just quickly bring this up. So hold on. Uh, Twenty. Let's see. Oh, hold on. Really did do a number on me over here. No, no, I'm a bit too far, aren't I? So apparently... Yeah, you're... It looks like it's up closer to the pier. Yeah, it's like right there, right by the pier. Get rid of this marker, because I can't use this marker. I don't know why I've got that marker there for, so I'll get rid of that one. Because I have a marker right where I got the um. Should be about thereish. Uh, no, not last fish. Just basically next to where Vamps is. Basically standing right next to his boat. Right next to his boat, that's what the marker says. Straight off the dock, yeah. Which is about 60 feet. Uh, we'll, we'll try... Hang on, I'll cast this one, because I know I can recast this one. Doesn't even look like this one even set to the ground yet. <laughs> oh! Snags. Leave me alone. I always seem to get snagged in the worst spot. You've reset. Which is basically about 60 feet out, exactly what I said. Not 61, but I'll go down a bit. So we'll see if firing fireworks off at the same time helps. And that started buying before the fireworks went off. Again, before the fireworks went off. <coughs> Normal bird bot. <laughs> this person was going to say, you're using the wrong bait. <laughs> if they've changed the bait to be something different, it's annoying. What was the bait um, used for the crystal bird bot? Well, for me, it was small. Well, I'm bot. asking Steve there. Oh, he put medium cut bait. He put it medium after the coordinates. Bait. Okay. So we'll see if that oh, one Okay, works. it's right there. Alright. Medium All right. cut bait? Okay. I'll change it to medium. Yep, I have. I'm using my last of uh, the small cut bait, anyways, so. Uh, where's my medium? I know I brought medium with me. Yep, I brought. I have a hundred things of medium cut bait, so I'm good. I have 76. I have loaded small cut bait, because that's what I got last time with it on. Uh, right. Yeah. Ah, just do a full swing out. There we go. 
I hit the spot, boom, and it goes down, swings down, in spot, boom, bash. And just in case, I'll set a firework off. It'd be funny if I could set off fireworks from here. It would be funny. It'd be funny just seeing you getting dragged around the lake with that, though, really, to be honest. Just imagine you just going around in circles because of the whatever fish you have just taking you around. I've had that happen, actually. <laughs> yeah, not, it's just funny that... Not here, but... Yeah, I've seen the fish drag you around before. It's hilarious as anything. Look, Santa, will you just get these Christmas fish to actually start buying? Because, unfortunately, you know, I've tried. I've already done this event once. Can't do it again. Because you won't let me. At this rate, I might as well just set the fireworks off and be done with it. <laughs> I'll just go. Eh, it's, it's fine. I'll just get the sun of cocoa. No, nah, here we go. Nah. <laughs> Jingle, jingles, jingles. It'd be hilarious if you actually have to now somehow get part of the Christmas outfit before you can start doing it. It'd be like, really? You're going to be that pathetic and stupid about a game? It would be. It would be ridiculous. Oh, that's pretty nice, actually. Oh, I don't really need the Christmas light on at this rate. Right, let's see. Let's go for... I'll get my brutes out. Why not? Boop. And then we'll do one of these. Go, 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 go. Run away. Ah. All I had to do was run away, not you. <laughs> it's on my fireworks. I mean, it's on my rods. No. Ah, oh, pretty colours. <laughs> you know what's going to be? It's going to be finicky with me because I haven't played on this in a long time. It's like, no, we're not going to let you have a fish. That's what it's going to be. Come on, fish. Bite. Take it. Take it now. And just nothing. This is getting a bit stupid now. Hmm. At this way, we might as well have a fireworks show instead. And this is okay. Let's see what I have. Vamp's got a bear bot as well. <laughs> yeah, I hope to actually get one. I was hoping to get a load of these Christmas event fish, which is starting to really annoy me. Well, I say Christmas event fish, I mean the white moose like fish. Christmas event. Let's see. Let's put more than one down. Oh, 
I've just finished that whole set off. Pretty. Ooh. <laughs> Very nice. Did not. Are they being serious? Come on, it can't be. Oh. What we got here? What we got here? What we got? Oh, look! Vamps gets one. Hi, I know, Vamps. Before you say okay, I want to. <laughs> we can have a look. So at least we can say someone's got one so far. And again, show off. Sh show off. <laughs> the only thing I get is the furry one. What do you get? You get the crystal one. What do I get? I get a lake trout. Look at that. I get a lake trout while you get the crystal burbot right on. Just... <laughs> so everyone can actually see. So Vamps has finally caught one of our crystal ones. Look how lovely that is, guys. And he is using a... I want to try and guess the rod, but I can't tell. The big ollie. The big ollie, okay. Uh, so what size hook were you using on that? Barbless number one. So not an art hook. Not like a one-art hook. Just the number one. Yeah. Just a barbless number one with right. medium cut bait. Right. So this might be one of the reasons why. Oh, I'm going to. Believe me, I'm going to. And then I will share that with Wes, so that way he will have a marker as to where to kind of launch his line out at. Yeah, so it could but be. The possibility is I've been pretty. using the too big a size of hook then. Because I've been using free out hooks the whole time. So it might be one of the reasons why I'm failing so badly. <laughs> That's where one goes, ah, oh, well, we all knew that. I'm like, okay. But at least we're learning at the same time. Well, I'm learning at the same time. Use your fish shell, use a free out hook. It's usually fine. No, it has to be a... What the heck did I just bring up? <laughs> That's the first time I've done that before. Okay. Use your hit the pause menu and it goes there, not to whatever that was. Uh, right, hold on. Uh, just the one barbless, yep. Right. What's that? Yep. Um... Let's see if that makes a difference. I'm only catching anything today. Might be one of the reasons why. It shouldn't, because it never did before. Right. Uh, no, wrong button. There. Let me hit this button. Let me hit this button. Thank you. Let me get rid of that mark I just had. Thank you. Let me add the marker, which is... Ooh, on. Oh, f Oh, you haven't. Sh Hang on. What the? That was the lake trout. Vamps, you shared the lake trout one. It shouldn't have. Lake trout. <laughs> I can I can show it on my stream. I Hang on. Lake trout. <laughs> It might be that the mark was close together, that's the reason why. Um, there we go, bear butt one. So yeah, Vamps got it before me. Show off. Show off, Vamps. 
They're quite next to the one I had marked in the right. So let's see. All right. To be. Try that now. Yep. Yeah, got it. So you have snow in yours as well, don't you? Yes, yeah, pure snow with the medium cut bait. Right. Well, I'm testing one with small cut bait, and I'll be using another one with medium cut bait. And they're both with a one hooks, not one ots. Just one hook. Just in case anyone's wondering. So I'll see exact. See, this is what I mean. Every time I do play this, perhaps you have noticed this. Every time I do play this, <laughs> mostly a few. What happens? Nothing. Nothing ever happens. It never occurs to plan for me, does it really? So I did manage to get the crystal burbot, yes. and he is still struggling to get it. I'm still struggling to get one burbot. I'm struggling to get any of them. Apart from the furry trout, which I caught, that's it. That's the only thing I've caught so far on here. Hmm. You biting or are you just playing around with me? There's your playing around with me. <laughs> or else I'm just plain friggin' lucky. Now, what happens is I'm your lucky leprechaun. Anytime I do anything, you get it, and I don't. I just have bad luck. <laughs> I think we discussed this last time. I just have bad luck. <laughs> I'm lucky for anyone else. Myself, no. <sighs> Come on. <laughs> oh my god, okay. Vamps, this has your name on it. <laughs> now I'm going to say this as a joke, guys, and I am joking. Hacks, he's hacking, he's hacking, he's hacking, he's cheating, he's cheating, he's nicking my crystal bird boss, I don't know. By the way, just in case anyone came at me saying that, I was joking, he's not. And this is why he calls me a freaking show-off. Yeah, every time. It happens every Steve, time, though. I'm every not... game we play... Well, every time we play Steve, this, he always gets it. I am it. not using a 4-0. I'm and look, just using a marvelous number one hook. Look, is all I'm using I'm a number using. one. Medium cut bait. And what happens? Normal bird bot. Normal bird bot! <laughs> Sorry about me shouting there, guys. <laughs> I'm just using a number one hook, and that's the second crystal bird bot that I pulled in. I'm going to have to call it the show-off at the end. <laughs> I walk in a huff. <laughs> and yeah, what's funny... again, guys, like I say, me and Vamps always have different experiences, and every time I've played with Vamps, especially for his live streams, I've always been really lucky for him. For me, i am always got bad luck when it's fishing with vamps for some well i'm not saying it's always bad luck when i'm fishing with vamps um it's just for some reason i do i do strike seem to strike bad luck when i'm fishing with you don't get me wrong there are days i fish absolutely perfectly with vamps i stream it it doesn't want to work for me <laughs> Man. And what's actually funny about this is Wes here was the one that really got me into fishing planet a lot more yeah, because obviously and Vamps was streaming at the time, and I then, advised him on how to get certain fish, and where, and I joined him, and obviously Vamps helped me get into YouTube and got well, into it more. When, so when I met Wes here, I was going after the Rainbow Outlaw in Falcon Lake, and I was either, I think I was either the second or third stream into trying to get it when he told me where to go, what to use, and everything. And so, you know, about maybe the fourth or fifth stream in, I finally managed to get it. And ironically, because I still remember it, because it was around this time of year, nonetheless. Yep. When I was going after this, and he's... He sits there and sends me a message going, watch, just watch. As I'm walking out the door to go to work, you're going to get the Rainbow Outlaw. Yep. So what happens less than 10 minutes later after him going to work? I freaking reel in that 
outlaw, and I'm sitting here laughing. He, about maybe an hour later, yep, told you. Yeah, because I literally check, and I literally just thought, I was like, knew it would happen. And because obviously, I think we spent, I can't remember how many days we spent there, and then we realized that there was a weather condition when it comes to monster fish. And obviously anyone who's now watching my videos on it, I would mentioned that there's certain weather conditions that certain fish need to catch them. And obviously I've done, um, I'm not going to spoil anything, but there are quite a few that need certain weather conditions, certain time periods, and certain yep. things for fish. So, obviously when it comes to me, for some reason, the fish just want to play horrible. So it's, it is like real fish, and you either have your good days or your bad days. Um, so at the minute, I'm having one of these bad days where the game wants to be absolutely finicky. Oh, look what I finally get because I changed my hook to a 4 art hook. So thank you, Steve, Yay, Ray, for that bit. He finally got it. Um, yeah. After how many so tries? So I guess mine has to be a four-out hook. So the game is being very finicky with players. Um, so if you, so guys, if you're not catching them as much as what me and Fabs have been trying, and we haven't actually been trying that long. Um, as you see, I used one at hooks. I've got you know different cut bait on one of my other ones. For me, I've got to use a four-out hook. Vamps can use a one hook. Yeah, that for us. Now, I am gonna try to huge, pull it off difference. with a four o hook and see what happens. Yeah. Um, now, as you can see, I've got a couple of different rods out. So these fish could be being finicky and funny because you need maybe a specific hook, meeting certain requirements. Obviously, Vamps definitely got, must have been meeting the requirements somehow. Um, could be because he's high, lower level than what I am. It just wants to be difficult for me. That's what it is. That's what it is. It wants to be difficult to me. Now, what me. I'm actually going to try and do, because I do have a bottom rod, um, is I am going to see what happens with a number 4-0 hook. Well, we're going to see if I get the lucky strike twice in a row. If it is, because I get it twice in a row? No. I just had a look at my side, just getting that bird box. So I'm going to say hook's not going to make no difference to me then. <sighs> This fish just wants to annoy me. That's what it is. It wants to hurt me. Even that's because I've got tons of white snow, pure snow. I've got like 10 bags of it. I have 10 bags. I have 10 bags of pure white snow. Not that type of snow, guys, by the way. Just actual snow. Game snow. Snow snow. Not the snow that you go around. You know what I mean anyway, guys. And yeah, it's don't like eat yellow snow, snow guys. Candy, guys. Just whatever um, you do, don't eat yellow snow. Ah, but I like lemon. <laughs> Face palming. Oh, and yet again, four o hook, and I'm still getting the normals. Um, yeah. But then again, a lot of streamers will tell you this game is very RNG, so you don't really know what you're gonna get. Yeah, you're gonna have your good days and bad days. Vamps obviously sounding a lot better of a day than what I am. I'm having a very bad day. Well, um, hey, you but then, finally got one, though. I did finally get one. I still need to get another oh, 200 odd, I think. Um, or 100 odd, something. Um, but yeah, this game can be a huge grind, as you guys may know. Um, and as you can tell, it's I'm, you know, we're still gonna have fun regardless if I've had good luck or bad luck. You know, I don't really care. As, you know, I'll show you now. For me, I've got quite a bit of cash. Oh, who's had me put me as a friend on there? Where is it? It says I have a friend on here. Uh, added friends. I have no idea. Oh, is that to do with... No, it's not to do with received markers. Where's the... Apparently I have a friend request and I have no idea where it is. Um, unless it's your markers. It might be a marker that I'm getting it's the request. It's probably on. the marker. Okay, it's the marker. Friend, uh, mark, markers give you a friend request. Weird. <laughs> That's weird. Um, but yeah, it's even just our experience, you know, like I say, our experience on fishing is very much different. You know, he's getting them on one hook. I mean, just a one hook. I've caught them on, well, a one of them on a four hook. And yeah. These fish are. You see, right now, I just got a meet 
me, medium cut bait barbless 4-0 hook on one of the DLC rods. I'm just getting um, the regulars right now. I still get a trophy. <laughs> That's just one of a one hook. I don't have any chance to medium cut bait if, my rod, if this rod can take it. Um, what rod is it? Actually, I can look. There is a way that you can actually look to see what you're using, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you certainly did help us both get one each. Uh, it's, it's, this is going to be a bit of a fun thing. Yep, but it's like thank the, you for the help there, Steve. Yeah, very much helpful and very much thank you. Uh, we're still going to try and get the or find the um, furry trout and the antlered salmon at some point. We've got to try and find them. If they're going to be very finicky or they're not. Um, but yeah, I, I, in my honest opinion, I think they may have nerfed the fireworks of what they're supposed to do for this. Um, if that, they're saying, no, nope, it's got to be on a certain day or a certain time period, or it's too, it's too early. It's got to be nearer to um, New Year's Day because that's when it'll work the best. I'm not going to guarantee that would be the answer. Um... Ah, I've got flash photography behind me. No, not again. Ah. And yet again, no more bird bot. Yeah, don't worry, I do have one with a four. Oh, hock on. It's just I want to see if there's a going to give me any chance of getting them differently. But yeah, it's like the fireworks. You're supposed to be able to get the salmon or the other by the uh, this and uh, at the minute nothing <laughs> but at least the fireworks are lovely I've got to admit that <laughs> fireworks are lovely love fireworks boom 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 um, you know what may have helped was the fact that you when I got mine it was back to back fireworks that you had laid down yeah but you just set off fireworks now and made no difference the crystal burbot isn't supposed to be affected by fireworks it was the um, fairy trout and the antlered salmon that's supposed to be affected by the fireworks and so far they haven't been well they haven't affected anything because I've got bait out there which should have been affected oh, yeah, on the float rod because before they would just be there all the time but at the minute I do believe they're bugged out for some reason um, that's me I, I could be Steve. completely wrong they might not be bugged out at all it just might be we're doing something we don't realise we're not doing correctly um, now obviously I've completed the Christmas tree part and obviously Vamps hasn't but then Vamps has actually caught the crystal burbot so it does prove you do not need to complete the Christmas tree decorations to get the crystal burbot so you know is there an actual reason why we're not getting them at the minute, we don't really know why we're not really getting well, them at all. <clears throat> so it does prove that he can still he can get them even without completing all the Christmas part of the event challenges. Um, but you know, if it's supposed to be all, oh, you're not supposed to have a great chance getting them. Well, how come he's got two of the crystal bird boss and I've only got one? And I've got, oh, there we go. There's number two. There you go. Two, two and two. Two and two. So yeah, we're on a draw on the bird boss so far. Um, but again, it's just one of them things. It's just been it's very. It's a twofer. Yay! Not gonna ask who's was biggest. Mine. Uh, <laughs> 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 I got the I got the biggest ego. Yeah, we know you got the biggest ego. Yay! Um, it was. Oh, you know dude. what they say? Size does matter. Mm, depending on how you use it, that counts. To be honest. And no one has to be <laughs> reported. Jeez. You know what I think is really funny though? How many times you get people who do put in like spam onto your chats? It's annoying. Well, someone told me that they do. They find the smaller streamers and they do that because the moment that they hit one of these bigger ones, and they're it, yeah. 
Yeah, well, I'm having to report them because I know what them type of sites are, so I'm having to report every single one. It's the same thing, so it gets rid of them, so I don't get the spam from them every time. I had it yesterday, literally 10, one after the other. I was like, remove, 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 you know, get them all reported, just so they're gone. And then I still get them come through with the names. I'm like, God dang it, people. Uh, people could be... Res- <laughs> hey, <what? laughs> oh, God. Okay, that was pretty good of you. That was funny, Steve. That was <laughs> Nice better. one, Steve. That was really good. And thank you for seven and the like. I do really appreciate it. I was going to say, if you haven't checked out Vamp's channel, I know he isn't streaming this, so I thought he was actually going to be streaming tonight, but he's not. Um, you know, the links to his channel is in the description, so you can go check him out and give him some love and some likes and some dibbity dabs on his subscriptions as well. Oh, we're going a bit lag there. Um, so, yeah, you can check Vamp's out. I know Vamp's. Well, we usually had done quite a load of collabs at the start of last year. Um, obviously, near the end of this year, we haven't really done too many. I know we do play quite a few games together still. Um, but, yeah, uh, just to let you know, guys, we will start doing some more collabs. Um, obviously, I've been playing quite a lot of PC games. I'm trying to get ahead of them a bit. So, I'm going to say about March time, I'll start doing more collabs with Vamps on quite a few of the console games. Uh, so, a few of my games may go a bit. I'm going to say kind of dead, but they're not. It's just I'm going to try and get as much recording as I can done ahead of time. So don't think I'm stopping my recordings, because as you may notice, within less than well, nine months, I've done 520 videos. Yeah. Um, I'm going to try and get quite a few series done ahead of time. Uh, so if there's no videos out during the middle of the day or near the end of the week, at uh, the end of the day, during the week times, it's because I'm just trying to get some episodes recorded ahead of time for you guys. Um but I am going to always stream on a Friday, Saturday, and mostly on a Sunday. And obviously it depends how things go with work. depends if I'm out stream through the weekdays or not. Because um, obviously I do zero-hour contracts. So I'm on random shifts just to warn you guys. So you never know. You might see me do a stream at one time at one week and not the next week. So I just want to give you guys a bit of a heads up on that. For what my plans are for the new year. Um, just in case I don't mention this. But yes, I thought I'd mention that beforehand. And see, the fish don't want to bite for me now. They've given up on me. They've run away. Vamp plus one sub. <laughs> uh, but in reality, it's how much Thank money you, you Steve. have. <laughs> Jack, that's the wallet law. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, dear. Well, 10 o'clock, more... Well, I have more cash than Vamps, but I bet everyone else has more cash than me, depending, no matter what, depending on which version of the game you're on. Um, this is the only version I actually have the most money I've actually made on this so far. But I don't mind. So I'm yawning. Saying that on the PC version, I made so many mistakes. Even in from my recordings, you'll notice I've gone somewhere gone. I've wasted so much cash at the end. I know I had it in one of my videos. Someone commented saying... Oh, you've gone to this location, but you didn't pick up any of this stuff. Why? What's wrong with you? I'm like, um, that wasn't the point of the video for me to do that. <laughs> Plus, I'd already collected the arms from that location anyway, so I'd literally just gone to the location twice. Um, and I then realised that there was a... the pre- I think it was the present video. And I then realised that I could open the presents. I was like, are you kidding me? I've just been to all these locations for these items. I'm like, god dang it. So that's why I didn't do half the stuff. Um, for them but yeah I can't, I can't believe I had that comment I was like yeah I agree I'd be banging my head too if I hadn't already got them <laughs> but I wasn't worrying because obviously it was on this version it was on the PC uh, the Playstation instead of the PC version uh, and I already had all the tokens and as you see how much ground bait I've got I don't need any more of the cookie ground bait it's just it's ridiculous just to have that much more um, come on, fishy, fishy, fishy. Oh my god, come on. Come on, I've got a few seconds to get you in and then I've got to change rods. Right, I've got to change rods because I know that's going to lose tension. Oh, it'll lose slack, right. You're being an easy one because you're a bird bot, normal. 
change back quick before that one goes because sometimes that will unhook itself. Dun 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 dun. Come on. I know you're a bottom feeder, oh, wow. so come on up. Hey! Nice. I finally got number three! Number three! And I got my tongue stuck on it. I need a hell of a hand, get my tongue stuck on it. I got stuck on it. I can't get my tongue off the fish. Pardon me? What was that, sir? <laughs> I couldn't get my tongue off a fish. Tastes like ice cream. <laughs> Vanilla! <laughs> Sorry, guys. He's um, licking fish, everyone. He's licking fish. Oh, I'll check my pet inventory. Almost all my pest event stuff is gone. Wow. Like what's the matter? Oh. Uh, no, I haven't got all three of these rods on the um, A4. No, he's saying I've... all three of your crystals have been on the 4 -o. Yes, they have so far for me, um, which is really good. I just want to see if I can get My one. My two on were on the just the number one barbless. Just the one hook. Just the one hook. Obviously, I'm using barbless because, like I said, I love using my barbless because it gives me a bit more cash and a bit more <laughs> And hello, Dr. Scrooge, I do see you there. Uh, on, on. I know. What's this? Oh, I'm not God. going to judge the woman you choose to surrender yourself with. Hey, eh? what? I'm not going to judge the woman you, <laughs> the women you choose to surround yourself with. Um, I know. Can I show this quickly? Oh, I know. Does it does it show me on here? I can't. I can't edit. Um, yeah, I've got a female. My character's a female one, so yeah, vamps you'd have to watch out. Apparently, uh, people if might. If I was streaming, I would say, um, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, I, as you may know, with my part of my description of my channel, guys, I usually play a game as a woman character because for some reason I play better as a woman than a man at times. And I, I, I have proven I play better as a woman on games than as a guy character. I don't know why. Even just, on uh, his Call of the Wild, he's got a female character. Yeah. Uh, Vamps has seen me play as a male character. I will shoot an animal and, you know, I could hit it dead on. It doesn't go down. I'll play as a female character. I hit it in the middle. It goes down. And you see me with the... Well, most of you may have seen my um, streams with the shooting range. I can hit my targets pretty well at the shooting range. Even ones that are far distance with a what was it the, the short scope and I can hit the far distance and Vamps has seen me and obviously I've streamed it mm -hmm. and he was shocked that even though I could do it as a male character as well that I can't bring down an animal as a male character by can as a female and he was like how is that even possible I'm like you tell me <laughs> you he's know, more in touch with his feminine side yeah well I do like my colour pink don't I <laughs> as some of you may know if you see me play you and the freaking pink tent I swear yeah I know well, you and your green tent. I don't know what's wrong with you and the green tent. What are you trying to do? Go back to Grove Street? <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Number four. Yeah, hey, I'm getting them on four, four ops. Um, it's weird. I'm getting them on four ops completely. <laughs> but yeah. Um, so yeah, I play as a woman character, mostly. Um, you know. But then I am more of a... PvE survivalist type, so I like to build and decorate and all that lot, as anyone will know. Um, I'm just a bit weird. Yeah. I'm back in the AV self. Oh, darling. Um, but also, another one that we will be doing a collab on is the Isle. Yes, we have to get all that one figured out. Hey, look, that number three. Hey, lovely. And um, I actually upped the size of the hook, so that was on a 4 0. So I'm getting more of these people putting in things and I'm going to get them all out. Um, but yeah, so just in case anyone's wondering, we do quite a few things. Uh, obviously, we should have Dr. Screw with us on that one as well. Obviously, Dr. Screw doesn't um, stream, but he is in with us on quite a few of these videos that we do do. Um, especially like Phasmophobia and a few other games. Um, right, I'm going to change this hook to a different one. Let's go for 4 on that. The terminal weight is optimal. No. 
I was going to say, I was going to say something else instead. I was going to go, no, Sherlock. And then I was like, no, <laughs> can't say it the middle bit. Um, <laughs> oh, hold on. No, bleep, Sherlock. Yeah. Um, try a five-watt hook uh, to see if you get a bigger crystal burb up. We know Wes. <laughs> uh, burb up's good. They get up to 33 pounds. And is that the crystal ones, or is that just any of them? Or do you mean bird box in general? If it's bird box in general, then the crystals could probably get about the same size. Um, but it's not the size of the fish we really are worried about. It's just getting them. Yeah, if we're able to get the minimum size. Yeah, we're just having fun getting them. Yeah. Um, but even so, we're still going to get the normal bird box. It's just a bit annoying that we're getting them. We do have to try and get some of them salmon fish and the antler fish. Um, well, I'm pretty sure if we were to change up our um, baits, we would be getting other fish. But right now, the only fish here on White Moose Lake that will literally go after cut bait is the burbot. Nothing else will take to the cut bait. Yeah. So if you're particularly going after burbot, no matter if it's the crystal or even if it's just the typical burbot, um, you do want to use the cut bait. Well, if it was the just the bear body, can use spawn sacks. Um, for some reason, I was getting a load of them just on spawn sacks, even though they were supposed to mostly yeah. get me the ant antlered salmon and the furry trout. And I've not had that. I've only had one furry trout so far out of the whole thing, which is annoying. Um, any of them? There's no info for event fish. But they say the set. Yeah. But they should be this. Well, from what I remember last year, I just needed to use fireworks, and I could use any bait, and that was it. I was getting them. Um, the spawn sacks helped and worked a lot better. But as you can see, I'm not getting a single thing of um, salmon, which is iron. Oh, have I actually got a fish on this one? Are you kidding me? I've had a fish on the float, and I've not even realised it. Fish on the float this whole time. What? <laughs> I've had a fish on the float rod for this whole time and I've not even noticed it. Um, hmm. Yeah. So, and as you can see, guys, my beeper wasn't even going off, and I had a fish on my on my rod. That that makes no sense. So, that's just weird. There's no indication of that bubble going down. I know it's out there a bit. See, that is my indications that I've got some on my rods. So, right, that's the four. Ot, nothing. Well, it's something, but nothing, nothing. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Don't tell me this is a crystal one. Or oh, this is a heavy bird bot. Well, it's definitely a bird bot on this one. Gonna say near on the trophy. No, stop taking it away. Come here, fish. Try two out in shiners for the. Okay. This is really fine. Look at the hat, it's just taking my line. Well, this is definitely gonna be a heavy one, anyway. And this, I think this is the weak one of the two. I'm using. I do have a third feed rod, but that's even weaker. That would definitely take me a long time to bring it in. Um, come on, you fish. As much as I'd love to drag up, that would actually destroy my rod. Yeah, that would destroy my rod. Well, my line, I should say. There we go. Yeah, I haven't seen any of the frozen minnows or frozen cut bait. That's on the um, Fisherman Fishing Planet. Oh, is it? Yeah. They didn't oh. haven't brought it for the free-to-play version, unfortunately. Because that is what you originally actually need to get the Crystal Burbot. But the way around it for the free-to-play version is snow it's and cut bait. Snow. Yeah. Um, so that's how they've done it. Uh, they may oh. have changed it on the paid version. I'm not going to guarantee that. But that's what uh, I don't know. Well, there's one way to find out. There's one way to definitely find out. 
and again. Told you it'd be a trophy, Burbo. <laughs> Dang it, every time. Oh, I'm not going to use this snow in time. I'm not going to be able to use this snow in time. Let's see if me throwing a snowball in helps. <laughs> Probably not know my luck. <laughs> oh dear. Mm. Yeah, I'm not about to use all this in time. It's just gonna be a waste of ground bait if not. I'll just get past this day. Take me to your leader. And I will beat her. And you'll beat her. I don't know. That's a point. Let me just quickly get rid of the bit of ground bear I do have in here. So I don't need that anymore. That can go. Yeah, bye bye bit of ground bait. Flat bye bye bit of ground bait. Five. Yeah, that's about the, the length of my lead right now is 55 to 56 inches and then shiner is 4-0 okay yep and what's for the shiners um for the antlered salmon shiners yeah Ooh. well <sighs> <laughs> um i'm not gonna say no to this <laughs> Um, yeah, just in case anyone's wondering, yeah, I got a lot of shiners. I was actually doing a going to do the thirty day at Saint Croix. So I just started doing it, and I was like, I can't do anymore. Um, I had I actually worked out how much bait I needed for it, and I had like five thousand shiners. Yeah, I'm down to a thousand. <laughs> That's why, as you'll see, actually, most of these are actually... Oh, it's at 10 inches. It used to be at 20 inches on the length. Um, I started messing around with a few things. I'm actually tempted to use my bottom rod to see if I can't get the... My oh, I don't know. Aren't we supposed to fish a certain location, or is it just anywhere on the map for the antlered salmon? Um, he was saying same spot for antlered salmon. So roughly right here in the same area, apparently. Hmm, okay. Well, I'll go for a 60-inch one. Now, before, you used to be able to use any bait. You used to be spawn sacks, and so... At least well, we can I've got show. something with the shiners right now. It's definitely giving me a fight. They can be pretty heavy. Oh, yeah. Then again, I'm I'm not sure if my <laughs> float rod is the best um, float rod for this map. Well, do you know what type you got on you? It's a narrow. It's, I just. I mean, I've been able to pull in some um, lake trout already with it. It's just not certain if this is the best one for it. Well, let's see. Spawn sacks. What have I got on my oh no, artificial eggs? What have I got on it? It's gonna be a diddle of a fish. Brook trout. I got brook trout. Okay, so let's see if we can get any of them salmons. <laughs> if they've changed the bait and how you're supposed to get these. Fish is going to be a bit annoying, to be honest. Um, hold on. Let's see if this will help speed things up. Maybe it make the shiners more glisten in the sunlight. That one did. Well, I'll give you this. Here's right about them shiners. See, now that is what you call an antler. 
<laughs> nom, 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 nom. <laughs> well, that was awesome. Fortunately, I'm using too strong of a rod for that. And thank you for that bit of information about the shyness. Be a bit of a trick to know if we could use um, minnows on them, though. That does help. And obviously, anyone else, it would help as well. So let's see. Does this help me get any more, any quicker? Ten point salmon. <laughs> Ten points. Ten points. No. One hundred and eighty. <laughs> and that time I'm only going to get one after every firework. There's definitely another one. And yet, this one I actually got a lot more experience and a bit more cash. You see, I've got to clip these. Apart from that one, I've only clipped one of them. I didn't clip the others. Oh, am I going to lose that? Nope. 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 Come on. Yay! <clears throat> and the fairy trophy. So it shines across the board on them two, then. Okay. That kind of upsets me that I bought a load of spawn sacks. Turns out it needs to be shiners. For nothing. Yeah. I should have just got more shiners. At least you get... After you had two of the fish take, at least it's paid for the shiners. For at least ten. So at least the other eight are actually making you money. Well, at least now we know that shiners... So if I do the perfect job for the, um, the salmon and that lot, and obviously with the fireworks. So fireworks will work. Give it a bit of a space and time, and it should help you get the fish we're after. Over 200 feet out, and I am still... Yeah, this is not the best rod for here on White Moose. <sighs> oh, you said you're using a what one, a Nero? Yeah. And what's what's a uh, height Nero? Ten ten. Um, go to um when you put your because I can't tell you right now. Go to where you can actually oh, yeah, see. Yeah, yours. I can tell. I can tell. I can tell. Yeah. Profile. Quiver. Fourteen ten. Yeah. Okay, thirteen pound max weight. Eleven pound drag. Yeah. You probably got a, what? Twelve pound line on it. Um, ten pounds. I think so. Ten pound if it was fluoro. Twelve pound if it was braid. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's taken over 300 out now, but now it's mm. not bringing it in slowly. Uh, I can answer that question for you. Do they so I'm pretty sure they can, but I think it, yeah, they can. But it's a bit more expensive. It's like an extra friend. I think you get shiners from the main I think shop. It's like an extra 10. I think it's like an extra 10, I think. No. Or Shiners here is 975. If I remember rightly, from the main shop in the lobby, it's 600 for Shiners. That's an extra 375. I'm not paying that from the shop for Shiners. No way. I will buy the Shiners from the main shop. Um, oh, no, I didn't want to do that. I've got enough cash for it. Don't get me wrong. No, I made 40, so far, I made 14,000. So, yeah, it's a pretty good amount of fish. Because, you know, I mostly caught quite a lot of brook trout. Um, I finally started getting my fairy trout, my salmon trout in. Uh, antlered salmon. And we've got some crystal burbot, which is absolutely amazing and awesome. And um, thanks to you guys, obviously, in chat. For, um, I'm yes, guessing you guys are you, looking Steve, up what you remember. Thank you, you um, Venomous because, Jack. I mean... You two have been quite, quite the help. Because if 
we had not had you guys in, we probably would still be struggling to find the Crystal Burbot. Yeah, but then I'd probably just be throwing my rods in the water and go, I'm off. <laughs> and like, but your rods are like, I don't care, they'll come back home. They know where I live. It's coming in. What yeah. is it? What is it? Lake trout. 12 pounds. I wonder I'd give you a fight. Yep. Hold on, do you have a leader on your thing, though? Yeah. So, you're using a titanium leader, fluoro leader? Yep, titanium. It's, um, bra it's a braid on um, 8 inch. Um, here, I can... Well, technically, you don't need to use a leader on with them fish because you're not actually fishing like a monster. Yeah. So, that might give you a bit more back if, the, uh, say, the leader's like a 10-pound test leader. Then your line... Because your line should be a bit more than the leader. Even though you could do it the way around and actually improves your line a bit for some stupid reason. It still works slightly. Not fully, but it does slightly at times. Yeah, so what I have on um, is a 8 inch and it's a 10 pound leader or a 10 pound braid. Because it's what I, I think it's what I could afford at the time. Yeah. And then the leader is an 18-pound test. So does that mean we have to follow the leader again? Follow the leader, 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 follow the leader, follow the leader. Sorry, I'm going to shut up now. That was funny. Come on, it was hilarious. Well, you heard me uh -oh. snickering. Come on now. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Most of the stuff in the like shop don't help. No, it doesn't. It gives you an idea of what the fish could be biting mostly. Uh... On the gives lake. you a general idea as to what to use but but the pricing oh my god the pricing can be insane that one's snagged why is that one snagged which one is it that's number one in it no that's got a fish on it see the bite alarm wasn't going off but I knew it was it was it had a fish on it I had one do that to me earlier that's twice it's happened to me now but it just lags the float in the spot it doesn't do anything. It doesn't move. It doesn't do anything at all. It's just glitched there. <sighs> Looks like I've got something to report to the devs or Fish and Planet team going, uh, by the way, do you realise that your um, stuff isn't working fully properly? Let me just reel this in pro fully quickly. I'm like, oh, no, it's not. I'm like, uh, yeah, it is. It's glitched. I got, I got video evidence. I got video proof. I got stream proof. That's no, not too bad. That's fine. Um, but yeah. So they're going, but they're not going down. Which is a worrying factor. See, that one's really moving for it. I can't tell which rod that is. No, I can. Now I'm kind of lucky because obviously, where well, I grinded quite a lot, I actually had made enough cash way beforehand. And now he's getting all the bear bots. Well, now it's four for four. I think I've got five, and I. Uh, let me double check before my Only time. Only one way to I, tell. I'm almost going to the next day. Um, Only one way to tell. Yeah. Pardon me. Right. One, two, three, four. Oh, maybe you're right. Four for four then. Yep, yeah, because I've gotten four. Four. Yeah. But the problem is, with using shiners, I hate it because if I'm not making more than what it costs me to get the bait, I get really annoyed. Even though I know, you know, it's spread between ten. You know, obviously, as you guys know, if you go to St. Croix, you get one pike gets paid for the fish. Um, almost regardless. As long as it's about £20 a fish. Um, well, even just catching one pike at St. Croix, one of them's going to have paid for that bait straight off the bat. And you're like, yay, the rest is profit. Even though it's a 
expensive place to go to to get unlimited license and it's not as bad what's that jack play fishing planet <laughs> <laughs> By watching you guys do this, I want to do it. Yeah, it is obviously we enjoy the game. Yeah, we both enjoy. But obviously, yeah, I'm getting to the daytime, so it's going to want me to skip to the next day soon. We'll see how this all goes. <laughs> I'm mainly an artificial bait guy in... Ugh. Wow. So I'm guessing Steve does quite a bit of fishing in real life as well. By the sounds of that. Uh-oh, you broke the line. It snapped it. Wow. I think my lead was... I think I had my... Drag up too high? Yeah, I think I had my drag up too high and didn't get the chance to really... Lower drag it. down, yeah. Sometimes you don't get to drag down yeah. quickly enough. It does happen. Uh... Do I get to get one fish at least before the new day? Come on! Bad fish! I've got like four minutes in game time before you go to the next day. Come on! Blast you fish! Oh no. That one's gonna go. That one's gonna go. Go on. Go on, number two. Go on, number two. Go on, number two. Go on number two. Go on number two. Who does number two work for? <laughs> Who does number two work for? Yeah, you show that number two one's bass. <laughs> what the heck? And anyone who gets that quote will be laughing their head off from that one. Um... <laughs> oh, Lawless. Ah, oh, man. Why the trophy burn? But God damn it. Yeah, go on. Tell me I need to skip to next day. It's going to cost me a thousand. A thousand. A thousand. Oh, I need to make the money for coming here. <laughs> Damn, China's going to cost a bit. Um, why in a lifetime fish license is my... <laughs> I own a lifetime fishing license in my state, if that answers your question. No. <laughs> yeah, it kind of does. Wow, a lifetime fishing license, jeez. Um, yeah, I didn't do much fishing this year. Bottom two stuff from yesterday. Uh, you ever felt so full that you feel thirsty all the time? Yeah. Um, but that's usually because I either feel like I'm going to vomit. <laughs> um, it depends what you mostly ate. If you ate like, dry stuff like turkey, it's going to make you feel dry. Or even peanuts, they're supposed to make you feel dry in the mouth, so you drink more. It's why bars used to always have the whole um, peanuts things on the side, which they don't really allow now. But you can still sell, pe but they still sell peanuts, and there's just so people will want to drink more. Alcoholic and non-alcoholic people, by the way, guys, don't have to just be alcohol. Um, but yeah, certain foods will actually make a person actually feel like they need to drink more. Um, so it depends what you ate for Christmas Day. That's the reason why you feel like you need to drink quite a bit. So yeah, don't worry. We've all been there a few times. Drinking alcohol or not. <laughs> um, you beat me to it. <laughs> beat you to what, Dr. Scroob? <laughs> the jokes? Oh dear. Let's just see. I need to check something quickly. Let me just come out of that because I need to refresh my thing. It's lagging a little bit. Oh, wow. Ooh. Ooh, wow. That's a uh, turkey, smashed potato, pumpkin pie, and more turkey. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm going to blame oh, the turkey. There's number person. five. Shut up. <laughs> Don't forget, I skipped my day more forward than you because I went to a peak time, so... Yeah. Show off. 
See what I mean, guys? He's, he's showing off. Look, you see them fish? They're the ones with the antlers on it, even though they look more like the ones with the Santa hats on. But before, you used to be able to look at the um, Christmas fish, and it was the one with the antlers on. Surprisingly enough, I think they may have changed them every, every year. Um, why am I? Let's just check these rods quickly. I don't want to find out that they're actually. No, it's fine. Did I seriously just see us on Santa sleigh? Yeah. Didn't, didn't you see it? You should just look to your right now and again, and you'll just literally see Santa in a sleigh with uh, four fish um, slaying the sled, if that makes sense, but yeah. You just to set the sleigh. It's not here at the minute, but I can give you a can. Hey, now, you'll notice in the water. Oh, the water in my jota don't taste quite like any water. So that's number one and number two need to reset because they're too far from base part. I'm on about the base, about the base. No trebles. I'm all about my bass, but my bass. No, do, do. I've always said broken over line then. I was going to say, what are you doing to break another line? Oh, I feel all hot and flustered. Yeah, don't you love it, baby? Yeah, baby, yeah, baby, yeah. Take a picture of me. Oh, yeah. Mm, ah, mm, ah, mm, ah. It's a fashion show. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. Right. Huh, not enough ground bait or it reaches the expiry date. What? Yeah, I had that happen. I still went to the next day. It usually expires when you go to the next day. Is the game being stupid? Weird. Oh, look, he got another antler salmon. Mm hmm. First one of this new day. It's a lot of fish. It's a lot of fish. Ear fishy, 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 fishy. Oh, that one's going to go down. Yeah, give me a sec to reset this one firstly. Now to go, then you go, then you go, up you do, up you do. Do -do -do -do. Well, that fish is flying in the air somewhere. Wow, why the lag game? It's See, a now case it looks of a flying really fish. Dark. I don't get why it looks so dark. You know, night time seems brighter than the daytime. Makes no sense. Fine, it's because I usually have a torch on. See? Anyone watching, obviously, see that? You can see what um, vamps is, and yeah. That is a bad bug. I should really fix that. I'm not trying to be offensive or anything, but yeah, see? That is bad. Bad, 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 bad. Um, but yeah. I say, this is a bit of a funny bug, but it's a bit stupid. I know somebody could, might take offence to that bug. It's like, really? It's not a good bug. And that's still been going on. It's been a year, over a year now that has been. I'm surprised I still ain't fixed it. You would have thought they would have fixed it by now. Well, I have reported it. And they said that they are looking into getting it fixed, and it's been a year now. It's like, really? You can't fix it yet? It was fine last year. Well, the year before last year, but this whole year's been like, eh, no. It's weird. But I do what I need to do. That's the point. Why am I not firing my own fireworks off? I've got so many. I I throw the firework down it, then even and then it starts beeping off. Before I even get it down, I should say. That bear boss wants to feel it per pot. Bear up. 
Flying fishy lake trout. Awesome. Um, I'm going to know what DLC I might get it next. Hey, what? Then I'm going to get what, what next? DLC I might get next. The float rod. The DLC float rod. <laughs> you and DLCs? I don't know. <laughs> See, and I don't do DLCs. I'm just sad. Um, uh, Steve Ray. My trophy was a uh, quarter ounce, one up, barbless, purple, narrow and a spoon, and that's for the. Oh, I like, sent him the. Yeah. Um, I sent him a marker earlier for the whitefish where I caught caught a whitefish at. Yeah, I've only got that up on there just so I remember to go to white moose. Um, so I set I said it ages ago, and I just was like, I need to have it set so I remember that I'm going to white moose. Like sometimes I've done it where I've actually gone to the wrong lake and went. Oh dear. And I've had to leave, quickly fish the lake and then leave and get to where Vamps was. Because um, usually I always set myself up at the location beforehand. Because sometimes I just completely forget. Unless I'm actually doing my own thing, then I'm like, oh, I'll just record what I'm going to record at the time. Sorry about that, guys. I'm yawning. <laughs> I had enough sleep and I'm still yawning. Um, so yeah, I usually put up little markers and little notes. Uh, if I was next to my PC, I'd have literally a bit of paper and it says literally on one of my screens go to this lake or you're gonna do this today and I literally have it down just in case because if not I'll go what am I supposed to do huh what um, and it just doesn't happen it's like I sometimes get sidetracked on a few things and I'm like that's why I have notes a uh, note for now and again to remind me what I'm gonna do I need to get myself a better schedule set up for streams and videos done so yeah, I'm yawning Sorry, I didn't get much sleep last night. Well, I say this last night. I mean this morning. I went to bed at like 11 a.m. I woke up at 4 p.m. I basically went to sleep when the shops open and the shop shut is when I woke up. I went, ah. Well, looks like I'm not doing my shopping today then. It's like, ah, it's yeah. fine. I actually, Steve, I got my white fish with a shiner. I was bait fishing. I don't know but yeah obviously with me playing the PS4 version I'm not really worried about when I get the fish um, it's when it comes to the PC version obviously I will do my videos of um, obviously you may have seen how I get my fish now if I find out that obviously other people have got it a different way I will mention it and I'll I'll have to pick, make a note and I'll make sure I highlight Yawning! What am I yawning for? Sorry. Um, I will make a note of your thing, the way you caught it from, and what you used. Um, I was going to say, if you are on PC, if you can find me, you can always send me the mark, and I can say, right, guys, this person actually found it here, and actually used this, and this is where they were. Um, obviously, so like you guys, a few of you may know, I do shout outs to people obviously for who give me advice on games. So, obviously, when I do a video here, when I do one about the crystal and that lot, uh, I will do a recording on PC, but it'll probably be next year. I might be able to get one done before the end of this year for them if I'm got a good enough rod to try and bring these in. And I'll give you guys a shout out for the help you've given me. If not, it'll be next year, but I will give a shout out for the start of the new year. On one of the Fish and Planet episodes, so do watch out because there will be shout outs for people. Because um, Vamps knows I always give him a shout out on quite a lot of things, yep. even though he's disappeared somewhere now at the minute. <laughs> um, but yeah, guys, like I say, I always give shout outs to people and you know, kind of show thanks and appreciation for you guys who help out. You know, I appreciate it, like other guys and other people do appreciate me giving my bits of advice or ways I do things on games. Because um, obviously, trying to help everyone out and have a great time with the games and whatever we do. Fisher Online. What is that? A PC or a PS4 game? Hold on. Um... 
Fisher on. I think that's PC. I think they do have it on PS4 as well. PC. Okay. I say it sounded like more like PC, but I'm I'm not sure if it's a PS4. They'll probably quote us in a second on Steam. Hmm. Fisher Online. I'd have to have a look to see what the image is. Um, to be able to know. I know most of the, some of the games on PS4. Well, I can bring it up right now because. You know, I have a setup. <laughs> Putting the parrot to bed? To you. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> That's a nice way of calling someone their, uh, their missus. I'm putting my wife to bed. Oh no, she's the parrot. Sorry, I'm, I might be completely wrong. It might actually be an actual parrot. Um, it just makes it sound he like it's. Does a, have an actual parrot. It, it, it <laughs> could, is, yeah, like. it could be. You know, it could be their partner or it could be their kids. You know, oh, don't worry, I'm just going to put the parrot to bed. You know, it's like saying I'm gonna dump a, a load off, uh, you know, in the toilet or something like that, and it's just dumping the kids off at school. Um, what was it? I'm I'm gonna drop a load off. What? <laughs> Taking the kids to school? Why you just say that then instead? Because it's much more funny the way I say it. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Um, I was say, obviously, we're on control at the minute. Uh, unfortunately, I'm using my phone. I'd be able to check from my phone. I think Vamp says he'll check. Um, but we can always, we may just check. Well, we'll have a look at the um, official online. I don't think I will. No, I don't think I will. I'll have a look anyway to see what it's like. Because um, I've taken it, I've actually got quite a few things bucked up for doing quite a load of videos. As anyone who knows and watches my videos, I actually take on a game and forget to finish the other series off. So, yeah, I'm kind of a bit backlogged on games I need to finish off and series. And it's like, I know some people are like, Connor, you've not finished this off and yet you're starting a new one. Why? I'm like, yeah, I don't think about it. So I need to really get on top of all the games I have got. I need to get them all finished off. Um, so that's yeah, why I actually want... actually looks pretty interesting. Uh oh. You, you say it looks very interesting, and I'm like, oh, no, you don't. Don't, because you say it, I'm going to have a look, and I'll be like, oh, I'm going to have to get it and get it into a series somewhere. Well, it's $11 for me. Uh, <laughs> don't, don't, don't be quoting prices, please, now. I don't, I don't want to be thinking I've paid out a bit already this year. <laughs> this year? What? It hasn't even got to New Year? Exactly. Um not to mention the fact that he actually gifted me a game this year, so which is yes, actually very rare for him to do. It's very rare for me to do anything like that, really, to be honest. Obviously, I did one for um, Alec and Sabi Unicorn a couple of months ago to say thanks for what they've done. Did one for Vamps to say Merry Christmas. I was going to do one for Dr. Screw, but unfortunately, he'd already gone and got it because he was like, oh, wow, well, I'm going to need to get this one. It's like, bugger. So, yeah. Dr. Scrooge knows about that as well. Um, but yeah. Like I've said to people, if I get up... Well, I know some people have asked me... Oh, what gonna... right now it's in early access. Okay. The game's in early access? Yeah. Okay. So might... right now, it might... Right now, I think the price is a decent price to actually get it for early access. Because I just now noticed that. But more content to get more views. Dev is constantly updating it. I'll have to. You have to remind me of amps and I'll have a look after the stream. Um, oh, fuck, I hit the wrong button. I'll, have a, I'll get my PC loaded up in a moment and have a look, but that means I'll have to have all this on hold while I have a little look. Mm. But anyway, yeah, like I was, um, why nice. Burbot? Hey, <laughs> look, a unique, unique Burbot, great! I think that I need but a Burbot. God dang it. 
I know I should be using fireworks more often. I'm not. I'm an idiot. Um, damn, if I have to pick up another game for another series. Uh, dear. Um, right, let me just get this one in. I will make sure he takes a look at it. Oh, sure. do bend that. Right. <laughs> Let me just. Sorry, I'm going to put it on. I don't know. Actually, I'll turn it so it. Ha 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 ha. No, no. Yeah, it's just PC right now. So I'm messing up. Right. Give me looking at vamps. I'll fire up my PC right now. Yeah. Right now it's showing it's um, early access. So I don't know. No, oh, I'll have a little look. No, oh, I'll have a look now. Like I said, I'll have a look. And I'll do the look right now. Seems I'm actually here and I can actually get the PC turned on. Um, I'm making a look at vamps because obviously I might not be able to use the controllers at exactly the same time for getting the fish in. And I don't want to risk wasting bait. Okay, release date. October 27th, 2019. Okay, so it has been out for a while. For some reason it's just saying... Um, it's yeah, but even though it may access. say it's been out since this date, it might still can still be in early access. You take um, seven days to die. Even though technically it went gold when it came out on console, they're still classing it as early access. Yet yeah, it's been in early access for... Well, it'll be eight years now. Um, and they don't want to... And they, Well... Some people know my thoughts about Seven Days Die, even though I do a series on it. I just wish they'd actually... The fun pimps would actually get their finger out their rear end and actually just sort out and help console players out. I'm really annoyed. Yep. That's why I've had to go to PC for it, because unfortunately they don't want to really help out console players. If they do, they will say, you've got to buy the new gens to actually play the game. I'm annoyed because I've got on PS4, and they don't want to do an update for PS4, even though they brought out a release of the game for PS4. And they bug it up on the um, information for the game. And they go, oh no, it doesn't have that. It's like, well, the last update was actually going to have them items in. And you, you can't find the person who has the information to release the update. They're being tight, in my opinion. I'm really annoyed at Fun Pimps. I was still doing my series on Seven Days to Die. But the next game they bring out, I'll get it. I'm going to slaughter it. No, I won't slaughter it. I just won't recommend anyone getting the next game of Fun Pimps. They won't get Seven Days Die? Fine. Won't get any. I'm not getting any other game from Fun Pimps ever again. They can't keep to the promises. They promise one thing and go back on it every five seconds. Like some game developers and companies, but at least they actually fix the problems. Fun Pimps, no, we're just going to lay it underneath the table or we're just going to block anyone who speaks about console games development. It's stupid. Sorry. It's a bit of a rant there, guys, I know. I know a few people who play on PC will go, oh, we should have it on PC anyway. No, because... Mm. But that's, that's just me. Uh, well, I don't have money to get right, it. Right, anyway. Yeah, anyway, I, I don't want to speak anymore about... Um, <laughs> Send these to the stuff. Right, so the game is called Fisher Online. Yeah. Yeah, it looks pretty good. It looks nice. Uh, so for me in the UK, it is eight pound fifty-four. They have some DLCs. Two DLCs, by the look of it. Yeah, that's why. It's USA, on. Canada, and I can't pronounce the other one. Siberia. I can't pronounce it, so that's why I did it that way. I don't apologise. I just my pronunciation is really bad, guys. Right. Let's have a little look. Something went wrong. Ha 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 ha! Funny devs. Okay, there we go. Right, let's see. Okay, that's development are aged. <laughs> what? <laughs> the, the, and the developer and publisher called R age. That that's actually kind of funny. You know, just the R and age, not R age. That that's I I actually find that very funny. Not trying to take the mick out of the person actually who makes it. It's just funny how their name is called. Big R. There's a big capital R. Then age. 
you know, so most like personally saying rage or our age. Like our age. It's, it's, I, that's why I think it's funny. Sorry. Somebody might go, what? How did you think that from that? Because I did. Okay, he's actually using net for actually bringing that up. Okay. That is that is fly fishing at its finest. I know, obviously, for Fisherman Planet, they haven't really got um, fly fishing per se. They've mostly got spinning casting rods, which is technically the closest thing that Fisherman Planet has to fly fishing. Um. Oh dear. <laughs> he's got a little weight over the. <laughs> Okay. Okay, so he's trolling. Is that he is trolling? Isn't he? No, he's not trolling on it. No, he can be trolling. Okay. Interesting. But he had the anchor down. I wonder if he could have had the anchor up and trolled with it. What I want to see is this big shark just take a bite of his ship. <laughs> Sorry, guys. I'm just quickly watching the Fisher Online um, trailer that they have for it. And it was just funny, they was on a boat looking around, not fishing, and it's like, well, I just want to see the shark just come out and just bite the chunk out of his boat. I, I don't see why he's always getting out the, getting out the uh, scale to weigh the fish every time. I don't understand it in real life, you know, you'd, you'd do that, but you'd usually keep that all that lot. Don't get me wrong, the graphics look absolutely amazing as well. Uh, that sounds pretty interesting, um, Venomous. Yeah. Definitely had to consider it. But I don't have a game, <laughs> I can't. Gotta really. look at names. Um... Power stop saying it was. It's great. I think Fish Planet is. Uh, Fish, sorry, I said Fish Planet. I meant Fish Online. It's a two person dev team, husband and wife team, I think. Oh, it's fun, um, Steve. I, I think that's why they've put in, obviously, the um, one of the pictures they've got uh, two gnomes, a man and woman, so it probably is. Um, and, you know, I tip my hat off to. The derper, you know, especially when it's a husband and wife and they're actually doing it. And, you know, my hat is actually off to them. Um, it's still an early access, so they haven't actually... F it has The game has been out since uh, 2019, but it's still an early access. It hasn't been fully released. They haven't gone gold with it fully yet. Um, that's not bad. Yep, I have it on my wish list, so it's one that I will most definitely get and take a look at. I'll put that on there now. I'll put mine on there now. Um, but yeah, it does sound really interesting. Uh, I'll have to have a look. Right, a bit more. See what well, that's good there, yeah. if they're constantly updating it because not a lot of companies like to do that. Well, if they're constantly updating, that is a good thing. Then. That is a good thing if they are constantly updating. Um, so at least they're keeping with sorting things out. Yeah. Um, but at least I'm guessing the developers, so we don't know the developers' names, um, but by sounds of it, they actually know how to fish as well. So they're probably using their experience and what they know how to fish and trying to put into development for the game, which, you know, again, hats off to them and a lot of respect for them developers especially they're keeping up with the game at the same time that they've got um, so yeah I'm, I give my hats off to these developers for Fisher Online um, like I say I'll, I'll have a bit of a look um, I might look up some videos <laughs> to see what if anyone's actually done any videos on it just so I can get a bit more of a grasp experience of uh, how the game is played but yeah uh, I'm gonna say I might do a vi uh, series on it don't quote me I've got a lot of series going on at the minute guys um, if I do take it on then you may see that it n my series drops a little bit for a moment because obviously I'm trying to keep up with other, well, get things done ahead of time anyway 
Uh, right, uh, read the dates in the update history. It's how I judge game on Steam. If the dev work hard, yeah. yeah as long as. Yeah, it definitely is. Um, it's always a good thing when they're fixing the bugs, especially when they come up. I know, obviously, when it comes to my big companies and they start. Where's my? Oh, there's my. Sorry, I've I've moved from where I was sitting to somewhere else. Couldn't see the. I couldn't see the marker that's staring me right there. I need to put my glasses back on. My glasses, my glasses, I can't see you but my glasses. Oh. I'm an idiot, I just... <sighs> I just realised I threw my... Fl I threw my feeder rods down, I didn't throw my floats in. My floaties, my floaties are running away, no! Oh, that's the wrong rod. Dang it. That's the right rod. Rod. Why do I so, that sound like I'm saying it like a different word? Different word. Jeez, my... Mm. Words and pronunciations are going really finicky today. Getting really annoyed about it. Um... But yeah, like I was saying, um, when it comes to quite a few... Oh no, hold on, what's going on here? Uh, don't, I'm not stressing, don't worry. Um, <laughs> shouldn't have licked that fish. <laughs> shouldn't have licked that fish. I, 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 I like eating fish. Oh, hold on, I'm going to drop my bottle now. What? He's drinking booze! No. It's not booze. It's juice. <laughs> it's dizzy juice. No, it's not. I'm not drinking alcohol. Don't worry, guys. Oh, dear. Right, come on, fish. You little fishy, fishy, fishy. You fishy, 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 fishy. I smell something fishy, 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 fishy. <laughs> oh, God. Vamps. Yes. I smell the fish. Oh, um, yeah, yeah. Oh, the no, fish. Oh, no. I smell that sussy Get fish. Me. Get away. Get away. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, he is sus. Oh, Vams is sus. He's, he's been hacking and cheating. No, I'm joking, guys. He's not. <laughs> he's the sus. He's the sus. He's the suspect. He was the imposter the whole time. He's a fish you in disguise. Of ghost. Oh, dear. That's why he keeps nicking off my, my fireworks. See, I put one down. See, I turn around just for getting this one done, and all of a sudden I'll turn back around and it just disappears. Famps keeps nicking my fireworks. I swear it. <laughs> See, Birbot, turn around. Look, it's gone. See, he's nicked it again. <laughs> it's all gone. I, I don't know it. how. It's all gone. I still can't believe I caught a burbot. Come on, give me some of the festive fish. Come on. Yay, I've hey, got a got furry. A that sounds it's wrong in so many furry. ways. But i got a furry trout. I've got a furry trout. That's I now realise how wrong that sounds. <laughs> But I got a furry trout. I got a furry trout. Oh god, I shouldn't be happy about that, but it's funny. It's that hilarious. Funny. So many freaking levels. You can just imagine somebody's gonna click that and go, oh, he's got a furry trout. They're just gonna reword it, aren't they? I can see it happening. Oh dear, right. How much battery has my phone got left? <coughs> Almost not nothing left. Um Think before you speak. Uh, if I thought before I spoke, Doc's group, 
do you know, I think I need help. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. I'm, I'm, I think to a certain degree. Therefore, I am. Uh... <laughs> Every, everyone knows I play but a uh, female oh character in games, so I, I don't need to keep on underneath wraps. Um, oh yeah, okay, yeah, I, I get that bit now. Okay, I've got a fairy trout. Yeah, all right. Yeah, I now realise what you meant by that as well. Jeez. Uh, that was good. That was, that really was good. it. Took me a moment to figure <laughs> that one out. How you? I just want to say sod, <laughs> but very funny and good one. Um, hats off to you for that one. Hats off. I tip my hat to you. Oh, dang it! I, I I get myself into more trouble than that one is worth. That's funny. Um, but yeah. That that was funny. That was hilarious. Oh jeez. Oh no. Oh, God. oh dear. And he lands. <laughs> hey, hey, if I didn't say the things I said, some of these jokes wouldn't be said, and it wouldn't be as funny, um, or wouldn't be as hilarious. So, you know, sometimes just not thinking about things about what I do and say is just much more funny. Wait. Oh my god. Oh, don't do this to me. True, but I'm 180, so yeah. <laughs> and they go, what? So go, yeah. Oh. I'm, all, I'm agent. I was around when the dinosaurs were made. Boink. See, I didn't even start it and it's going off. Why is it every time I put one down, it goes off? Literally before the fireworks even fired. Oh, look. It's a splake. In the lake. It's a splake in the lake. Ah. At least it's not a cake. But I like it. I like it a lot. So I'm, I was gonna say I'm guessing most of these um, Christmas fish prefer it being night time when the fireworks are going off. God. Is there my channel? Like it. Uh, how long have I been streaming for? Because obviously my phone's three hours. Three hours. Um, my phone's almost died. So yeah, right, I'm going to bring these in and I'm going to call that it for today's episode, well, today's stream, guys. Oh, what? I actually, oh, snagged, okay. <laughs> I thought I'd had a fish then, I was like, what? That's been... <laughs> so we call you Bilbo then. <laughs> Bilbo? What? What do you mean, Bilbo? The Hobbit? Bilbo? What? <sighs> Not Lord of the Rings quotes, please. No, I don't. Ugh. No, no, run away, run away, run away. No, 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 no. I'm just one of these people who's like, ready? It's almost where you want to go, Harry Potter. Just really annoy someone at the same time with it. Oh, look, I can collect my snow again. And it's going to return to home. It's because the day's refreshed. Uh, so, Vamps, don't forget to pick up your snow and your Christmas present again. Because yeah. the timer reset like 46 minutes ago. Yeah, I know exactly when the timer's reset, guys. Hey, yeah, that was some more fireworks. <laughs> Surprisingly enough. Saying that, we didn't try doing the kayak to get the um, holiday fish, but it seems they're not buying us as often. That's the reason why I'm not going to be doing it. Um, what was I going to do? I was going to do something then just to. Oh, you know what? Hold on. See, it wants me to. Uh, does it say. Use a certain number of fireworks. Blow up 250 fireworks. I'm at 96. Okay, you know what? Seems I'm not going to be able to do it. 
this year and I'm not really going to risk whatever it is. Do I have enough? No, I'm not fully there. But you know what, guys? We're gonna, I'm going to set off all these fireworks I have. Believe it or not, I'm going to set off every single one. And you'd be like, but you're wasting fireworks. You're wasting them all. Why would you do this? This is a waste of fireworks. Not really. <laughs> um, I don't think on the PS4 I'm going to get time to be able to do this whole challenge as much as I wanted. But we're going to launch most of these fireworks. Make a glitter colorful display. And I'm not going to be able to make it that too colorful. And we'll fire one more down. Why not? There we go. Never know, I might save for the new year and actually try and get enough saved up. No, oh, I'll set one of these up as well, why not? Whee! I've got so many to fire off, I'll just do that one. There we go. There we go, that's probably enough fireworks. I'll try and save some more. <laughs> Celebrations! Woo! <-hoo>! Um. <laughs> so, yeah. I've definitely used enough for today. I hate the odd number there. It's got me of two. When I'm, I'm sure by two on that one. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. <laughs> anyway, guys, thank you so very much to everyone who's been on the chat today. So let's try and find everyone who's been on the chat. <laughs> uh, so we've had uh, Venomous Jack. We've had Steve Ray. We've had Dr. Scroob. Uh, no, not you, because you put something that shouldn't be there which I didn't notice till now you hang yourself there uh... <sighs> for all sakes oh my god how is it I've not noticed these ones earlier it's because I wasn't watching the chat, that's why. Um, I can't remember who else was in the live chat now, because obviously it doesn't go that far back. Dang it. Um, Thank you, Dr. Scroob. <laughs> yeah, very true. Um, but yeah, guys, like I said, yeah. thank you to everyone for being with us today. I, if I've missed calling out names, unfortunately, it's because I've not been able to remember seeing all the names on the chat. Because um, obviously, I'm on, I'm using my phone to watch the stream and the chat. Of course, it goes to a certain amount, and that's it. Unfortunately, when it hits that limit, I can't go back any further. If I was on a PC, I'd be able to check the whole chat. Um, Unfortunately, it means going through all the PC stuff again. It's one out. Uh, but thank you to everyone who's been on. Obviously, thank you to Dark Shadow Vamp for being with me on stream. Uh, links to his channel, like I've said quite a few times today, is in the description, guys. It's literally pretty close to the top. Uh, so, obviously, thank you to everyone who's given us some tips and helped us out with some tricks and some locations of where we'll be able to find, obviously, the Crystal Burbelt, the Furry Trout, and the Antlers Sam, so thank you both for that as well. You've helped me out and Vamps to find them and get them. So I do really appreciate it. Obviously, thank you to everyone else who's come along to watch. Even if you've not been in the chat to speak, at least thank you for coming along and watching. Hopefully, we've been able to answer a few of your questions. We haven't done exactly the best and had the best of luck for it, but we have tried our very best, as we always do, or as I always do. And Vamps always seems to show off by getting more. Sod. <laughs> Yep. He knows. He knows. He, he knows. I'm being friendly about it. Don't worry, guys. Um, yep. And obviously, we're all having a laugh, so we're all having fun. Um, but yeah, guys. Hopefully, yay! I'm on his boat. I'm gonna nick it. No, I can't. Um, I wish. Dang boat. Show off. Uh, but yeah, guys. We we try again to as far as we could and the best we could with it. Unfortunately, Mac, we've said and you've seen. We've yep. tried our best. Unfortunately. They've they must have changed some of the settings. Uh, 
but hopefully you've all had a very Merry Christmas. Obviously, Happy New Year to you all. I know we're saying it a bit early, it's just in case you guys who may be watching a repeat of this, Happy New Year to you. Uh, so hopefully enjoying the rest of your day or your weekend, depending on when you're watching this. Obviously, anyone who's watching it during the stream, thank you for being here with us on the end of the weekend. So hopefully you enjoy the rest of your week, your month, your year, special events, special occasions, and whatever else is going on your life. Obviously, it's going to be New Year soon, so Happy New Year to you guys. Or if you don't celebrate New Year's, whatever special event you're going to have for it instead. Hopefully you're able to keep to your New Year's resolutions if you have any. Me? No, not really. They've just gone out the window anyway. <laughs> <laughs> it's just me setting up dates and times for doing series. So just like I said, it's pre-warning. If I haven't got any videos coming out during the weeks for the next month or two, don't worry. I'm still going to be doing my streams on Friday, Saturday and Sunday. I'm just trying to get quite a few videos done ahead of time. So it may affect me getting normal videos out during that the week. I will try and hopefully get some more videos for Fishing Planet out of me playing on the PC. It's just um, it's taking me a bit of time because I've literally just realised I've got like a load of videos to upload and then edit uh, through YouTube itself and then get all the edit all the information done. So I'm going to try and get catch up on that through the next two days. Not going to promise I'm going to get it all done, but I've still got recording to do at the same time. So as you can imagine, it's going to be a knackering job. But it's going to be well worth it. And obviously, thank you to everyone who's been liking, subbing, you know, hitting that bell, loving, and, you know, asking questions. We really do appreciate it and we really enjoy it. We're thankful that you're here. And I can't wait to see you all again back on the lake or it, on any of the other games that we play or the series. Um, I do really hope you enjoy them. Like we say, if you have any questions, you know, come to the streams. You can ask, just say you've got a question about this game this is your question and we can either answer it while we're playing that game if even if it's not that game that we're playing or we'll be able to do a video on that game for that question you know I don't mind doing it I know I've had a few people ask me before even if we're just playing the game which is a multiplayer like um, Fish Plant when I'm on the PC you guys have seen me answer some of the questions so we're happy to answer them as best we can you know slingshots you know how they get used or what they're most used for or what the benefits of them are basically hitting people the other side of the map if you've got a long enough distance with it <laughs> or vamps his case he's just thrown at the back of my neck with his hands while i'm shooting them at the back of his head i don't know who's hurt more mine or his even though i use less to hit him with <laughs> just because they can go further ha! um but as you know guys by now stay out of trouble because it's our job to be in trouble or my job to be in trouble because i'm the one here fishing the lake trying to get rid of the um getting rid of the monsters even though there's no real monster here Hmm. But hopefully you've enjoyed, and hopefully our information has been great for you. And I do appreciate everyone who's been in the chat. Like I keep saying, obviously there's a few people who keep coming in and putting these weird adverts. I am not happy about it, so they will be getting reported again. Uh, but hopefully we'll get them stopped at some point. Hopefully YouTube's algorithm sorts that part out. Hopefully. Um, but I do appreciate everyone being here and having a laugh with us. Yes, and I always ramble at the end, as Vamps and everyone else will know, and anyone else who's watching will know, I do ramble at the end because I like to show my appreciation. Yep, the Voodoo Master, which is uh, just another robot, pretty much. Yes, and I will do a video on that fish, but that'll be a later date. Vamps has already got it done, I'm pretty sure. Yep. Yeah. Um, so you can always go check his um, videos out on his... I think, you live, I think I'm pretty sure you live stream it. You yes, live I streamed it, I think. I can't remember. Yep, I did. I think the I was there, next, being an idiot. The next monster fish that I am actually going to be going after, and it'll probably... It's not going to be this weekend. There's going to be no dream this weekend because of some edits. Yep. That are going to be happening. But... Mm -hmm. um. The third will be the first official dream for me. Aha. Uh -huh. Awesome. For the new year. As yes, you've heard it here first, guys. Vamps will be doing his first dream on the 3rd of January 2022. Woo! <sighs> normally, what, normally I would do, um, you know, one on Saturdays but because it is a first yep. and there's going to be changes happening at the beginning of the year so if um you want to um you should have my discord link down below 
that you guys mm. can get in on the action on, on your channel yes they will have the, they'll have the link to your discord in your channel i haven't got it set on mine i might have to sort that out at some yep. point um but feel free to join both of our discord channels we do have yeah mine's still under separates. construction so i don't really have mine out yet guys um i will get on top of it at some point <laughs> it's been it. under this construction for seven months is. i know i I'm, I'm terrible at trying to sort things out it's just eh eh i'm like oh, can't be arsed and yes yeah, there's work to be done for it i'm like eh, it's under construction I, i've just literally slapped mostly a construction sign on it on my wall i'm like under construction need to fix no will it ever get done and i've written underneath it going what do you think and i'm like never i'm like good answer i'm like but it needs to be done and it's like i've literally got this running commentary of me just saying to myself to do it and i'm literally just every time just throwing myself myself in the face and i've had it where i put it in the kitchen going are you sure you want to have that drink now when you could be sorting this out i'm like yeah i'll take the drink and that's it um i've i've, I've ready to have to get onto my discord and sort it out i'll try and get it done at some point don't quote me i need to I need time off for it. I know I've got time this week, but I'm trying to catch up on a thing. Anyway, ramble, 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 as everyone else will be saying. So I'm going to finish it off by now, guys. Anyway, thank you all so much for being here. Obviously, Vamps, thank you so very much for being here. Yep, as always. As always. And I'm going to let you do the outro, because I've already done my outro. So your outro is... <laughs> Keep gaming, everybody. Keep and gaming, Happy guys. New Year. Happy New Year, and bye for now. See you later. Enjoy the fishing, and we'll see you back on the lake right and early, guys. Bye. Bye for now. Fishy, fishy, fishy. Bye.